business is. Hello? How's it going, y'all? Uh, it's here? your boy. I'm with everybody else. What up, crew? What up? What up, Joe? Peace up. Hey, so hey, we got a new guest today. This man is an inspiration to me personally. You're going to see the dogs jumping in the video. It's my best friend, my ace. <laughs> what did I tell you about that? I <laughs> had to. I had to. Uh, Mr. Duran. Mm. What's up, y'all? How y'all doing? Yeah, yeah. yeah, this dog that you guys see is Sparrow. Uh, he jumping in. He jumping the camera for us. Dude, I don't know what it is. Like he knows when I'm actually talking to someone. Like the TV, he's not like this. But you know, whenever I'm on a video chat. It's like he just needs some attention. Mm -hmm. That's how they do. So I can't help you. We're bro. gonna do something pretty simple today. We're gonna play some D and D later, of course. We're gonna see what happened because vocab's character Silk decided to run off left field <laughs> and down the pit of destruction. Hell um, so yeah! I hope, you run all, I hope you roll all one for the rest of the game. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not so, hating. I'm not hating. <laughs> you so might hate. We're gonna get a quick news up brief, a news brief first, and then we'll jump into the game and uh, we'll uh, kind of roll from there. Uh, the first thing I did want to pull up for those of you who play League of Legends, there's been an update. You didn't know, now you know. Lil Nas X is the president of League of Legends. He is now the new president of League of Legends. Uh, he recently took over after the uh, stepping down of their current president. And so we are looking forward to some big, big things coming from him. He's going some specific music for the game uh, and a few other things. Call yeah. you up, call you me. Does he play the game or anything? I'm just kind of curious because I I heard this story and I didn't know what was going on. So my understanding is he does play. Um, he's not like pro level, but he I'm saying he enjoys the game. You know what I mean? Uh, and so he decided. I, I don't know how to how to I don't know how the inner workings of it was, but I guess he he said, "Yo, I'm trying to trying to get in where I fit in." And he got in. So I can't be mad at him. Money said puppy. Puppy. <laughs> yeah, hey Money, what up? What up, Money? So uh that was one of the things. Uh another quick update is doo -doo. we got Hunter back. Yes, sir. Next long volume for Hunter X Hunter. To be released on November fourth. <coughs> and not wait. I cannot wait. I cannot wait. It's been four years since the last uh the last the uh, manga chapter was released, I think. Four years, nine months, three weeks, and seven days. Yeah. Yeah. I'm lying, I just made some numbers up after the twenty. Years. <laughs> That's not about right. He was not much. keeping track. Okay. <laughs> right, right. He was like, Come on now, y'all. I think uh, it's been four years since a manga volume has probably been released. Yeah, That's manga volumes. Yeah, not the anime. The manga. Oh, volumes. we're not even talking about the anime. It's been over yeah. ten years. Bro, that's, that's like eight, nine years now. I think it's almost a decade. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, I'll I'll take a bold prediction and say that's going to probably be the number one selling manga of the year. I will take a bet on that right now. This year, you think? So my Unless one piece is, has is another volume coming out this year, or is his wife writing it? No, he's still writing it. Okay. He's still writing, as far as I know. And he got assistance finally. So I know at one point in time he had said something about if something happens, he's gonna let his wife finish it. I'm with it. Don't get me wrong, because at least to whom of y'all who did not know, his wife is the the uh, creator of Sailor Moon. I okay. didn't know that. Yes. Yep, they made a reference to that. Yep, he's, he's, the, he's the creator of Yu Yu Hakusho and Hunter Hunter. She's the creator of Silver Moon. Yeah, I mean, if yeah. that's not a power couple, I don't know what is. Yeah, fun fact. I was, man, I was just finished watching this um, Yu Yu Hakusho, the Dark Tournament over the weekend. Um, when you see 
Kawama dressed as Tuxedo Mask. That was him shouting out his wife. Yep. Yeah. That was a shout out. Yep. And if you pay attention, it's a lot of like um, especially in Hunter x Hunter, you'll see more of Sailor Moon and um and Yu Yu Hawking show references. Especially just pay like when you see a shelf of toys and stuff, especially I think a cool bar room, you'll see like little stuff from the other not cool bar room, um not gone, Kalua's room. When they go to Blue's house, you see like stuff from right. you have to show there. Oh, okay, that's pretty cool. I didn't, I didn't look for that before. I will definitely keep an eye on that. Yeah, definitely keep an eye on that. But like I said, one piece doesn't have another volume coming out this year, do they? I don't think so. I don't know. I don't think not this year. No, I wish I could go with you. Okay, that's the end of the year, and so they got to go through the numbers. Now, if you say 2023, looking forward to it. Have a good one, man. I don't see nothing new coming out that's gonna outdo Hunter. You know what I mean? Because Bleach yeah. was out this year too. Like Bleach finished this year too. That's why. That's the only reason I'm saying that. Bleach is probably gonna get a push with the anime. That's obvious. It's gonna get a push. Hunter Hunter with a volume not coming out in a couple of years. The way the manga industry has shrunk a little bit, especially with the pandemic, I can see. Hunter Hunter being probably the top selling manga of the year and it comes out in November. I wouldn't be surprised. Okay. okay. I'm, I'm not gonna argue it. I mean, I could definitely see that being being a uh a, a contender. I definitely say it will be a contender. Yeah. Um, top yeah, top selling volume of the year. I could definitely see that. I, I could see that. They have a very, I know Hunter Hunter has a very passionate fan base from what oh, yeah, I've heard. Definitely. Definitely. It's, it, and it's going to be, I think, I think, I, I can see where you're coming from. I think that first chapter, though, is going to determine how the rest of that fly, like flies. You know what I mean? Like if people keep coming and staying with it after that, if they don't come with that heat that first chapter. First two chapters. We've been waiting for too long. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, first chapter. Yeah, hopefully this whole time Tagashi's been on break. At least he has an outline for the end because I think at this point it'd be sad if he doesn't finish the tale. Honestly, I mean, like I said, we had Berserk's creator passing a couple of months ago, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. And nobody wants that to happen. You know, nobody wants to see that again. That would just, you know, that just be sad. That would just be very sad. That would have, yeah, that would be. I mean, there is, there are a lot of mangaka that, I mean, they they get to that point. Like we were talking about him before about how he couldn't finish the the, uh, the manga in the first place. Uh, that's why he took that hiatus, and it's just like, yeah, because he has crippling back pain, he has arthritis, and he's getting older. Like he should be doing what um Toriyama does with Dragon Ball, but I think Tagashi just wants to. Finish it, hand and paper, which you know I can respect it to to a certain degree, but the mind might be willing, but the body's just not. Right, the body might not be able. Yeah, yeah. Like I know he said he wants his wife to finish it, but hopefully, if that, hopefully that that doesn't have to come to fruition. Unfortunately, it's just hope and pray that doesn't, because making me think of a good manga that ended. Thinking of High School of the Dead right now. Honestly, that was a. That was a that was getting good, and then the manga could pass away, unfortunately. So, right, ne- never got an ending to that one. Okay, so money up here stirring the pot early. I see. What she said? She said, "Oh Lord, she sold this." Vocab updated his top five. No, we not doing this, bro. <laughs> <laughs> We're not doing this. She said you updated your top five and put platinum men above fairy tale. First off, anybody who knows vocab. Knows that he's not putting very many things over fairy tale. One piece is about it. Like, this, uh, listen, Jay, this is not true. Okay. And platinum, the Eden worst ending in anime history right. over fairy tale. I don't know. This is the first of all, we hey, everybody here hates platinum and bro. No, I don't hate it. I don't hate the anime. I never finished the it, end, so I can't say the otherwise. The end pisses me off. That's this all. Was trouble because of that. Yeah. This yeah. is. It's definitely it's not going over fairy tale. One Piece, Full Metal Alchemist, Fairy Tale, Naruto, yeah. then Bleach. That is what it is. That's your top five. 
I'm not. That's what's I'm gonna need you to send me that recording. We don't got no recording, bro. Right. Yeah, we gonna need we gonna need record proof of this. We don't need recording. I can't believe that. Screenshot because it's not something. Because it's not true. All right, money. We gonna need we gonna need receipts. You you can't. We 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 talk with this man on a regular basis. We gonna need receipts, honey. <laughs> Look, the blasphemy the website, which has the has my email address in there. You can send me the receipt personally. If it's true, I'll verify. I'll put it on the next stream. I want a summer jam screen. <laughs> I put it on the summer jam stream. Summer jam stream. Um, but in the meantime, because we don't like reporting incorrect news, <laughs> we're gonna switch it up real quick. I do have uh, an update that Rod sent me. This was hilarious. So, Nuzlocks, when it comes to Pokemon, those of you who know what they are, uh, <laughs> oh, this you is know what they are. And here comes all the mind sick to count them, but like, at the same time, I literally got caught by a. Oh, what's that? Is that you? Is that me? Oh, okay. So, uh, for those who don't know what a Nuzlocke is, a Nuzlocke is basically where. Well, there's different variants of it, but you pick the first Pokemon you run into, and that's the Pokemon you keep until it dies, basically. You have to make sure you name it. Once it's dead, that Pokemon is gone, period, point blank. You're only allowed, like, one per route that you hit, right? Just a general idea of what it is. There was, I guess, an interview, and in the interview, some reps from Nintendo stated that they did not like the nuzlocking of their game. Uh, Rod, you want to go with that one? Yeah, let me clear that up. It was, it was two former the the people who actually put out the article were two former Nintendo of America employees. Uh -huh. Um, Kit and Kathy used to do. I don't know if you guys know the Nintendo Minute that was on their YouTube channel for a little while. Um, it was their former hosts. They were interviewing the um Japanese. They wanted to do a Nintendo Minute on Nuzlocke. But Ooh. it sounded like my something was lost in translation between the poke. It was it wasn't until it was actually the Pokemon company themselves that said they didn't like it, but they were confusing with something else people do with Nuzlocke, which is I think I might have mentioned this to you guys before. Randomize where you can randomize the Pokemon and the exact roots. So let's say you're playing Pokemon Red as a Nuzlocke and it's randomized, you can run into Mewtwo on the first route. And I played, I played randomizers. It is fun. If you know the game is a good way to make the game harder, more fun, or if you just want to challenge in your favorite game, randomizers have always been a fun mode to play. But Nuzlocke's in and of itself, the original way to do it, randomizers is something technology and YouTubers figured out how to do over the years. But a traditional Nuzlocke, as you mentioned, Panda, is yeah, you meet the first Pokemon on a route, and you just catch them. You get your starter, you then know, each route you go to, you just pick up a Pokemon. What happened was when they pitched the idea to the Pokemon company and Nintendo, Nintendo <laughs> thought they were talking about a randomized Nuzlocke, not a normal Nuzlocke. Uh, so, yeah. Miscommunication, sir. Very bad, yeah. Miscommunication. So, yeah, and Pokemon ended up kind of saying, no, we're fine with Nuzlocke. We don't want people messing up the files or doing anything to alter their game. That's where the confusion came into play. Other than that, Nintendo's cool with the Nuzlocke. They're cool with the Nuzlocke. That's what's up. That's what's up. Yeah, they're, oh. good with, you know, they're fine. Like, Nintendo says you can you can play the Nuzlocke. If you want to play, like, let's say you have Sword and Shield, you want to do a Nuzlocke or Sword and Shield, that's fine. They don't want you to alter the game or randomize the game. Because with the randomizer, you can do anything. You can randomize the Pokemon. You can randomize the item you get. Hell, you can even, with some of the ones I saw in recent years, you can even add the fairy type or the steel type back into Gen 1 or Gen 2 games if you want to go that route. So you can add those types back in if you want to do that. Or Honestly, even... That's not the whole game at that point, though. Exactly. That's, that's where yeah. the confusion came in. You can even switch up the TMs if you wanted to do that. Change out the Pokemon's abilities. You can um, go. I've seen randomizers crazy. Even people do super random where everything's random. The items, the Pokemon, the abilities, what they evolve into. So you can have a 
let's say you have a Pikachu and you use the Thunderstorm, it can evolve into maybe a Mighty Anna or something. I've seen that. I watched it on TikTok. Yeah, it, it yeah, it's wild. It's wild what some of these randomizers can do. So I can get Pokemon Company's point. That's why they're the clever. They don't mind if you got a legit, if you're using your, your legit copy, like let's say I was playing Pokemon Sword right now and doing another block, that's fine. Because it's just a self-imposed rule. You're just making the game harder for yourself. That doesn't mean that you're they just don't want people randomizing, especially Captain Pokemon like that you're actually supposed to work for. Mm-hmm. Yeah. for exactly. Like playing Pokemon, let's say Heart Gold Soul Silver, and then you get Lugia on round one. You just destroy the whole pro- purpose of the game. That that's the whole thing with Nuzlocke. But like I said, Pokemon Company did come out to clarify that. Like they're fine with Nuzlocke as long as you don't alter the game in any way. So, like I said, miscommunication and was just bad headlining from those former employees from Nintendo of America. Okay. okay. So, I've got a question. Is there, were there any other Pokemon updates? Because you're a Pokemon person. There's just one more. We got um, Scizor is coming to Unite next week. That's probably you know, the more exciting thing. There you go. Yeah, people have been waiting for Scizor, and you can also have them, you can keep them as Scyther, too. So they're trying a new gimmick. I'm not sure they do this in other MOBAs, but what they have been doing with a lot of the more recent Pokemon Unite Pokemon, they've been be- being more experimental, like Dodrio. Um, it's a speedster, but you can stack up the points. You can, like, if you only want to score 10 points, you can just score 10 points and come back later. Um, Mew, I still haven't, I just unlocked Mew and Unite um, last night, so I haven't had a chance to play with them yet. But Mew is totally busted. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I just thought about something with Dodrio. So let's say you got 10 points per head, right? Yeah. And you drop off, you decide you want to drop off 10 points. If somebody takes you out, you know how you lose a certain set of points. Do you only lose one of the heads points or does that, it across the board? That I don't know. I think it, they think, I think it's you lose half of whatever every head you got. So let's say, each of them have like eight. You're gonna you're, each head will have four, something like that. I forget okay. how the math works because I, I didn't once I heard that gimmick, it, it didn't fit my play style, so I didn't I wasn't gonna buy them. I'm right, um, right, actually right. just saving my. That's why I didn't get Tyrannosaur either. It's just not my play style. More of a defense support. I can play a speedster if I'm like Absol or a Gengar, but um, other than that, I I struggle with the other speedsters. But Scizor, I like the gimmick. Because people have been wanting to play with pre evolved and also have the option to play with evolved Pokemon. And Scissor is one of the first Pokemon they're trying that out with. Because some people want to, yeah, because some people wanted to play with the baby Pokemon. Like, like you know, people want to start the game with like Yolu or Pichu or Hapini. And then um, the Pokemon Unite people are like, no, we're not ever putting the baby Pokemon in the game because we don't want, we don't want to have fighting babies, which I understand completely. I I understand it. Like nobody wants to see you babies know, fight because you have them in the game. We can fight with them in every other game. That is a weird stance, but that's their stance. I mean, mm. God bless. But you know, oh yeah, and then the, and another Pokemon is coming too. Um, Panda, Clefable's. The, I think the next Pokemon after Scizor. So it's Scizor, that. yeah, yeah. Which I'm kind of surprised they did another Gen One Pokemon. I thought they'd go Gen Three or Gen Four, but. I get it. You know, Gen One's the most popular generation. I, I get it. I get it. For it's, a, it's, it's the generation that brought everybody together. True. Well, is- on top of that, though, if you really think about it, it's the generation that's least known by the today's youth. That's our generation. You know what I mean? So if they start bringing back some of the, especially remember we were talking about them phasing out Pikachu as like the pro, like the prototype Pokemon. If you phase out Pikachu. That's the only thing most people that started in the later generations know about Gen One is Pikachu. Maybe you know Charizard. What I mean? Pikachu and the starters. And Charizard, right? Yeah. <laughs> like the 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 starting three and Pikachu, basically. You know, well, starting six or nine, uh, and even more recently, Eevee too is looking like right. a secondary master. Yeah, yeah. Eevee, right. Eevee's the switch over from Pikachu. So if they really want to keep the original one fifty one relevant they've got to start bringing them into these newer games true yeah, that's you know? true like i guess they, yeah because the unite struggling along nothing else really going on i mean 
trying to think. The only other thing going on Pokemon wise is just if you go to GameStop, they're giving out shiny and turtles cards, and it's one per every game, which I kind of found out the hard way because I was I thought you could use the code per game, but it's just one one code for one game, which kind of pissed me off. But don't forget McDonald's got cards too. A word? Oh yeah. Hold on, let me zoom in on that. Put it back up. Oh, that's Rob. Oh, that's not. Nice. Oh, that's nice. That's shiny. Yes, it's shiny. Oh, man, you better put that in the sleeve. That's gonna be worth some money. Oh, this is my daughter's card, man. She, uh, she, my. Okay, so my mom know I play Yu Gi Oh, but she told my daughter I got cards too. So she, when they came up here, she was looking for my card. I'm like, I don't have Pokemon. I only got Yu Gi Oh. So she said, "Well, you can have these. So you have, um, you can add to your collection." I'm like, oh, you so sweet. Aww. Aww. That's nice. <laughs> that's, that's I got nice. vocal singing, y'all. Hit the deck. <laughs> this is, you know, cool. Christian Moana. I know this song. Yeah, yeah, that's what was going on in the Pokemon world. And then I'll just do one last thing here for me, One Piece wise. In case you guys are interested, where I'm at on One Piece, uh-huh. anime wise, I am up to the episode, the flashback episodes with Ace. That's where I'm at right now. Okay. So I'm almost at the end of part one. So I'll be in the new one probably in another week or two. Yo, I'm in your hood sipping juice. What's good? <laughs> oh yeah, this story. I was waiting for you to bring this one up. Oh uh, yeah, you know I was gonna bring this up. So you did so, so, see so, this came up this past week and it's been blowing up across the internet about how the voice actors for dub only got paid three hundred dollars each. At least that's the claim. Wow. Um I will say this, and this is coming from, and the film did earn over thirty million in the U.S. Hands down. I will say this, this is coming as a voice actor myself or a voice artist myself. When it comes to contracts, if people do not read that contract, that is not their. I mean, that is not the production company's fault. That is their fault. You know, there are different ways you get paid. There's royalty share. And there's PFH, which is pay for uh, like P. Everybody's different, but it's like basically it's paid per hour, pay for the hours that you work for it. So mm-hmm. if it took you, for example, let's say you get a hundred dollars in PFH, paid per hour, that means that when it's done, when the, the final product, not your editing time, not your recording time, none of that, that when you're done, if you only recorded three hours of actual material to give to that producer that company you're only getting paid for three hours worth of time so it took you four hours to record it took you another hour and a half to edit it you got paid a hundred dollars per that final hour of actual work of like what what the recording actually ends up at and when you walk into those things you you have to read those contracts you know there's nothing coming up right now about what their contract was you don't know you see what I mean? Mm-hmm. I can't get up in arms about it if they signed on and say, "Yo, I want to get in on this." You gonna give me a hundred dollars for for three hours worth of work? The movie was only what an hour and a half, that's right? About right? Yeah, yeah, about an hour and a half. About an hour and a half. So if that's the case, three hours worth of voice voice work. If you think about extra stuff that got cut out of the movie, right? Parts mm-hmm. of the script that they just wanted extras done, stuff like that. That sounds about right if they were getting paid a hundred dollars an hour for the work that they did. But if they did not sign up for a royalty share, they are not entitled to it. It's like the guy who did um The Witcher, you know. He he owned the books, he wrote the books. I think it was, I think it was like I don't know if you remember this, Duran. It was like, was it like four or five books of The Witcher beforehand? Oh, something like that. Yeah. And then he sold the rights off. He sold the rights off before the video games took off and came into fruition. Once Ooh. The Witcher 3 hit, we all know mainstream really locked on The Witcher 3. Yeah. You know, so 1 and 2 had been out already and made money. And then the TV show came out after that. All this money. And then he got oh. mad after the TV show started coming out. Like between Witcher 3 and the TV show, he got mad and started talk, trying to like talk about people. I'm like, you, you can't. You sold all your rights, all of them. That was your fault. 
Yeah, that's the thing. Like with a lot of these artists, they don't read they don't read these contracts. I mean, he, I, like, just to kind of yeah, especially with anime manga. I mean, voice like I said, Panda. I mean, voice actors only pay so little. I mean, because they're only doing an X amount of time. I mean, unless you're in a union. I know some of these. I don't know. I think I think this was a non-union. Um, I don't know if this is union or not. I'm guessing probably not because they probably if it was a union contract, they probably would have some sort of royalty, some sort of residual somewhere. A and that's little the thing bit. They don't. They don't though. Like I, because I've looked into it just to like for my own personal pricing when I do things. I've looked into it. They, it depends on how you set it up. Like there is a set amount per hour. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like this is hourly wage type deal. You know, so much for so many hours worth of work. Blah blah blah. There is that, right? There are guidelines for that. But it's, there's not an automatic because you're a voice actor, you get royalties. You don't. No, nope. same, it's same thing. It's the same thing in the music industry, too. Like, just because you made something, you don't make something just because you made the music, don't mean you have the masters or the. Oh. Or to switch it back here a little bit with comic books. Think about Marvel and DC. Why do you think like most of these writers or the original creators they got screwed when they made like Batman, Superman, one you know back in the day, like forties and fifties? I mean, watch the um, documentary. I don't know if it's still on Hulu or not, but like Batman and me about how they were trying to get Bill Finger, his family was trying to get him to be credited as a co-creator of Batman, so his estate could get all the you know all the royalties and everything for Batman. It's like a very, very good watch. A very good watch because honestly, DC did him dirty. But then again, just like they did the Superman creators, they caught him when they were desperate. I mean, think about the if you know the story for Superman co creators, they sold the rights to Superman for I think $130. That's it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. $130? Yep. And this was, this was back in the 30s. That was a lot of money back then. But who knew Superman? And wonder what's gonna in. bring so much money in. Mm-hmm. And then an interesting thing speaking, I'll just I just want to mention this while it's popping in my head right now. We got the things coming up with public domain. I mean, there was that Winnie the Pooh horror movie going out right now, and yep. in a couple of years, Batman, Superman, and Wonder Woman will be public domain characters, which means anybody can do their own take on Batman, Superman, or one oh great. Anybody can get it. I'm so excited for that. Oh, I'm killing as Superman. A, a um, I don't know, man. Yeah, I'm skeptical. I think they're probably gonna find some way to uh, hold on to that property. I no nope. FTC I said know, no. They tr- they've extended it. The, the extended the public rights domains for years. You can kind of blame Disney for this in a little bit because they didn't want Mickey Mouse to go into public domain, and they mm-hmm. got it. FCC said yeah. we're gonna extend it one more time. Then once uh, property's been over 100 years old, it's public domain. Or oh, I think it's 120 now, it's too. Thing. Yeah, that, that's the rule. Mm-hmm. You know, so part, at so, so many years after that person is gone, it's a wrap. So it's yeah, funny, so- like you were saying that, like the, uh, I forget his name, the guy who is over Black Sands Entertainment, which if you don't know, uh, Black Arthur, Mangaka, yeah, what they I know, want a Shark Tank. They want Shark Tank. I remember that. They were on Shark Tank. Um, but he he had there was a conversation he had, and I saw on his TikTok, and he was like, somebody compared him to the black. They said he's the black, uh, and he said, I don't want to be the black Stanley. I want to be the black George Lucas. And people got mad at him, and he came back and explained. He was like. Stan, don't get me wrong. I love Stan Lee. Stan the Man Lee is that dude. But Stan broke. Mm-hmm. Compared to George Lucas, Stan's broke. He has none of his stuff. He has no rights to any of the characters he created. He created them for the machine. Mm-hmm. That's it. He gets his props. He gets, you know what I'm saying? He gets fan love and all of that. At the end of the day, George Lucas owned his ish when it came to Star Wars. He had money in the bank. Yep. And he was like, I, I love Stan Lee, but I'm trying to be like George. I'm trying to own my ish. Yeah. Fan love don't pay them bills. Yeah. Right. Fan love don't pay them bills. They don't. 
Mm-hmm. Like, funny enough, you're talking about rights and celebrity and everything. I don't know if y'all, I mean, she just passed recently. I hate to bring this up while we're on this topic, but Michelle Nichols about her stating, like, how, how her her she don't fail, bro. I said she just passed <laughs> recently. Damn, I'm just bringing it up because it's kind of relevant to the topic. Damn. Yeah, yeah, go ahead, go ahead. I got you. I got you. We're talking about, like, rights, you know, we're talking about rights and everything like that. I mean, shit. Who do you think will take care of Huck? I mean, if you saw the battle between. Her, her son, her son and, uh, and the other gentleman, like that's some legit shit right there. I mean, that's something to worry about. Who's and for those who don't know what he's talking, about, basically her manager was living on their property in like a guest house, and the son is like, "Yo, fam, like you got to go." Like you, he was the manager was taking money off of supposedly taking money from their estate and then also living there as well. So. It was a whole big thing that he was trying to deal with. They were trying to settle out before she passed. And I think they're still going through it now, even after yeah. she, she did. Yeah, there's like a special one on Hulu. Like, it's called Whose Side Is It? Or Whose Side of the Story Do You Believe? I forget the exact title, but it's on Hulu. Like, It's a good episode watch. But to circle kind of to bring it back to this Jusu Kaisen thing, it's just like, I can see why they want to pay 300 I mean, it's a prequel to to this series. I mean, you're not probably not going to see these characters. Yet, so they kind of oh, yeah, so probably... I can't finish the hair. So they, so they probably lowballed them, too. I wouldn't be surprised they lowballed them. I wouldn't be surprised. I'm thinking about... um you know, I don't know who does the dub for Jujutsu Guy. I don't know if it's Funimation... Or, wait, not Funimation. Excuse me. Crunchyroll. I'm not sure if they're the ones who did the dub or not, but... I know, I know some. I know some of that stuff's union or non-union. I think it was something. <laughs> um, you know, like I don't want you to know what. Like I, I only watched like one episode of Jujutsu Kaisen, so I don't know. But I know Zero's a prequel, so I'm assuming probably you're not going to see these characters ever again. Mm. Like I, said, I don't know. You guys are probably know better you never than me. Know, though I mean, you got to remember the way Oda wrote One Piece has opened a lot of people's eyes because even in platinum in as much as you don't like the ending even in platinum in there were a lot of throwback pieces that you saw from episode one that came back to bite us in the butt you know what i mean like i think people when when you have great authors no matter who the author is you can take take actual like novels for instance right uh i can't remember which one came first uh, Lord of the Rings was first. Lord of the Rings was first. Harry Potter came after that, right? If I'm not mistaken. I believe so. I believe yeah. so. You're, you're definitely right. Yeah. Thank you. D, D got me. <laughs> it's like, I was like, which one was it? I can't remember. Uh, so, if you think about how Tolkien wrote, Tolkien inspired, Tolkien and Stephen King inspired a generation of authors. Hardcore. Hardcore. Any any author that came up like when we were kids will always be like they followed one of them two people. Either they were either Dean Koontz, Stephen King, J.R. Tolkien, right? Or Martin. Oh, no, no, no. Or Martin. <laughs> the, the authors were because a good author they introduce things into their story which make you as the next generation of author want to be better. You want to outdo the people that you like to read. You know what I mean? True. Um, mm-hmm. When mangaka, they quote Toriyama a lot, right? Because mm-hmm. Toriyama was that goat at the time, right? Dragon Ball has been around for the ages, right? And so they still to this day will be like, yo, I use Toriyama's this or that or the other because they wanted to improve upon what Toriyama did in that story. Whether it was the first one or the second, you know what I'm saying? Dragon Ball or Z. And they went from there. No, you got a point there, Panda, because like I said, I've been watching One Piece. And how many times have I tell, kept telling y'all, Imperial Dark just keeps reminding me of Muscle Tower from Dragon Ball? How many times exactly. have I said that? How many it times does. have I said that? You have. And it, yeah, and it does. Yeah, but Yu Yu was one of them classics, right? Yu Yu Hakusho is another one of them classics, you know? And so it's just like, People are people. They want to do better than what was there before. So I don't know. I think it'll be interesting. 
Uh, but back on the original, <laughs> back to what we were. We veer. We veer. Y- y'all know how we are. We veer. But back to the, the claims. Like, I understand the outrage for it, but these are dub actors, right? Mm-hmm. These aren't the original voice actors. We know for certain the dub actors, for the most part, are American. Y'all niggas got to read. Or, or, or one of it. Part depends on where they're recording it too. Because I'll bring this up. Because it's kind of a fun fact. Yeah. Sonic, um, Sonic Prime, the new Netflix Sonic series. Fun fact: mm-hmm. Roger Craig Smith is not voicing Sonic in that. Want to know why? Oh. Because it was filming in Canada. They recorded on lines for Sonic Prime in Canada, and Canada doesn't use uh. union, union actors. So that's why they got another person voicing Sonic and Sonic Prime, which incidentally is a black person. So you know what? I do not mind. I'm not with it. I'm not mad at it. I'm yeah. not mad at it. I mean, Julia's still alive. The actor who played Earth Soul voiced Sonic Jaleel, in the one part. Jaleel. Jaleel, Jaleel, yeah. Jaleel, Jaleel. He he was the original Jaleel. Sonic in all anything Sonic cartoon back then all was him. Sonic. Okay, okay. Yeah. From the games, all that. All of it. Except yeah. for I think what Sonic X was the first one he didn't do. Yeah, but that was okay. four kids. That was a whole. Day. That's another different animal for another day. That's why, though. That's why. It, that's why it wasn't though. And the like the the thing is, I don't know. Let me stop. Let me stop while I'm ahead because I'm gonna go into a, a trench. Y'all know me. Um, but but voice voice contracts, any contract. I guess all I'm gonna say is make sure you read. Oh yeah. Growing up in Indiana, we had. I don't know if y'all remember if y'all had um programs for reading it was a commercial you say read indiana read i tell people that to this day on the regular basis like whatever state we read read missouri read like i'm gonna need you to focus on what's actually in front of you before you say yes because you cannot get mad at me afterwards and even if you do i don't care you said yes all right but people people don't want to take that into consideration you know what i mean they this is not this again another tan. We are in a society of people who want to pass the buck so badly mm-hmm. that they will ignore what they would hold someone else to. Oh, uh, it wasn't me. Mm-hmm. But like I said, that's all another conversation for another day. We ain't trying to get philosophical. Oh yeah. Tonight. <laughs> not tonight. I, know, I saw Ron gearing up right now. <laughs> Out in his eyes, <laughs> Rod was about to be like, "Oh, we going here?" Bet. <laughs> Philosophical. So, um, only other thing I really wanted to hit on, and then we can get started because I don't want to go too long because I know the game's gonna go a little while too, and everybody got to work tomorrow. Uh, um, quick, what you talking about? Wanted to hit on was this. <laughs> My guy, mm. everybody's daddy. J E J. Oh yeah, everybody's granddaddy. <laughs> That's my granddaddy. <laughs> my granddaddy. You know what I'm saying? Everybody, daddy. everybody the dad that everybody wanted. You know what I mean? Like we all loved our dad, but dad, what everybody wanted. <laughs> Mufasa like himself. Man. You know what I'm saying? Um, he he sold his rights to the voice of Darth Vader. So from this day forward, Vader is no longer going to be James Earl Jones. No. Um, they're talking about in some in some instances doing a amalgamation of AI technology with his voice clips from over the years and everything he's done, yeah. which they have a wide range of stuff to pull. Right. So my question is, how much did he sell it for? God, look, it wasn't disclosed. You know they're not, you know they not gonna get that number. Come on now. Come <laughs> on. We just talked about a story where we got voice actors paying get paid three hundred dollars. Right. Home. Like you know, we good just know they're not about to that number. Because <laughs> we look. Okay. First off, let's see. We don't. We don't know how much he made off of that role. First off. <laughs> True. It would have to at least be enough to retire him again. Yes, thanks. If it was, if I'm just saying, the money was good. 
The offer the money is good, good though. That was offer had to be good. That money good. <laughs> I mean, we know he got Disney money coming in still because Lion King mm-hmm. Mufasa is still Mufasa. Mufasa <laughs> is Mufasa. Coming to America. Coming to America. Amongst his other acting abilities and gigs, like he good, he good, he Gucci. Can I? Can I? Simba, make you are the one true king. I want all the granddaddies that we all love to be in the same movie. <laughs> We can't. Some of them passed already. I know, but the ones who were left, I want all of them in one movie. It would be good. Man, all man. Yeah, six hours getting the wreck. I was gonna say who is all left. Look, right? take this chair and bring me that one. Hey, Although, what well, would be, uh, you know, dads for us are now grandfather, so like Lawrence Fitzburn and right. probably Samuel L. Samuel, yeah. Lord, Dude, that's only. There ain't no granddad. That's on. That's ever on. <laughs> Uh, Denzel Washington. Yeah, that deal go there, bro. Uh, who else? Who else? Who else? Oh. Damn. Nah. Ooh, why? Have been Avery. Avery gone though. Long little shredder. Oh damn! Yeah, Ooh, I just you're right. An idea. I just thought of an idea. It's. It's uh, do another. I, I can't believe I'm actually saying. No. I'm gonna think this out. Oh, right. about Jinjo Throw, the about old school, the like comedy legend, black legends. What if they did another Harlem Knights using them as the older people? Hey, oh, I'm not against it, bro. Hey, I'm throwing an idea out there. Shit. I'm throwing it out there. I am not against it. it. I mean, Eddie Murphy could still be quick. I mean, everyone else passed on at this point. I mean, shit, it could be. Okay. Yeah, you could throw Eddie in that mix. You really could. Damn. We got to get to this. Throw Eddie so, in that mix. How did Park throw Barney? Park throw Will Smith in there somewhere? I don't know. Nah, he ain't granddaddy age yet. He ain't, he ain't, he ain't in that, that bracket yet. You must have seen Will Smith when he took that picture and everybody thought he was Uncle Phil right before he went skydiving. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's, uh, after he played uh, Carl in Family Matters, is it a Reginald something? Is he still alive? Yeah, he's still alive. He's still alive. Uh, yeah. 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 So we have to leave it like. Yeah, that'd be that'd be nice to get them all together for like a man like a family reunion type of movie. Like, like they all they all old uncles at the family reunion or something like that. That'd be nice. I mean, okay, um, a documentary sit down. Right? I'm finna switch from my tablet to my phone because we're finna play D and D. I need my tablet to play. Got gotcha. you. Good. We got you. B R B. Yo yo. But like, even if it was just a documentary sit down with all of them, think about the now. Like, if I could just sit in the room with them dudes. Ooh, I'm surprised. I'm, you know, I'm surprised I haven't done something like this yet. Oprah, Loki, no. actually, Oprah okay. doing something like this. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. In an you talking about an interview sit down? Oprah would probably not want Oprah to do it. I would not want Oprah to do it. Who would you? Do? I don't think she would. I don't think she Oprah really would. understands the impact. I talk moment. Full on guy talk moment. Oh, okay. I see where you're going. Okay, I'm thinking this is a sit down. I'm thinking sit down interview. You said sit down interview. That's why oh, I picked Oprah. No, no. I meant like we all sitting at the table and just chopping it up. Oh. Black man, the black man, granddad passing on knowledge before they go. Hey, I'm damn. Gonna watch- you know who would have been the perfect host, but he passed. Unfortunately, you know, be perfect for this. Bernie Mac. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yes, sir. Long live. Yeah, it'd be Bernie. Like, live. I know somebody might think Steve Hart. No, nope, this is a Bernie Mac type no, of situation. Steve, nah, Steve didn't do it. Uh, long live it. one of the goats, man. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Bernie Mac would have probably. What you're thinking of, Panda? I think Bernie yeah. Mac would have been perfect for this. Hell yeah. Um, Wayne's brothers. Wayne's Wayne's father. Pops. Eden. John Witherspoon. Ooh, yeah. Not Witherspoon. Witherspoon would have been another one. No, you talking about Kenan Ivory Wings, the dad. Ivory Wings, yeah, yeah, Kenan, yes, yeah. yeah. Kenan, oh, Kenan's, Kenan's the oldest brother. Oh, is he's he? His brother? Yeah, Kenan's oh, the oldest brother. Oh, but who's the dad? I forget the dad's name. 
It might be Witherspoon. I think that's I think that's what it is. From a show or in real life? No, we're not talking about a show. We're talking about like their actual family. Oh, oh, oh! Was oh, their oh, father famous? There's a lot of them. He nah, brand He created them. Right, he created. Keenan and, and Ivory did create Living Single, and, or not Living Single, uh, Living Color. Living Color. But he's the oldest brother. That's the oldest brother. Though. Okay, okay, okay. That's who I was thinking yeah. about then. I thought it was his dad. I'm not gonna lie. Y'all can shoot me. I'm my bad. Nah, I, I, thought lie. I, thought, I thought he was the, the pops too, bro. I ain't gonna yeah, lie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lord. I think Damon is number two. Yeah. I think so. Yeah. But I still think he should be. He should be. It should be somebody like him. You know, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. no, I get what you're saying. I get what you're saying. I can see Will doing it. I can see Will facilitating. I could. And y'all can be maybe, hey, I don't know. Maybe like he, he's probably another year or two where, you know, he could. Hold up. Hey, bro, you, you extra wavy, okay? Yeah, you mad. You got you know, fat as hell, boy. Stretched. I don't know if your phone <laughs> doing it or Oh, fat body ass. No, <laughs> oh, sideways. Oh, that's true. Money's true. That's right. Florida is under a state of emergency right now, too. That's crazy. Oh, whoa. What's up, Vocab? Y'all good? What's going on? Well, I'm good. What do you mean? You said y'all in a state of emergency. Who in the state of emergency? Florida. Uh, the hurricane? Oh, no. Oh, oh well, well, yeah. Hurricane. God, I'll wait for a hurricane too, low key. I'm just looking at the date here. No, you know what? I'm lying. Yeah, There's uh, no water anywhere, bro. Come on and burn my head. No <laughs> <laughs> really, Mario? Come on and burn my head. They over there singing "Burn My Head." Man. <laughs> hey, get your camera. I That's a classic. Hey, That's a classic. <laughs> Come on, that was oh, right there. That was literally right there. You, know, you got different resolution, like on your camera, like a like a smaller resolution on it or something. Let me see. For some reason, it's stretching you out in the chat. There, there you go. go. That's better. That's better. That, that's not it. Sus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold that's on, good, that's on. Good. Wait one second. Wait one second. Oh, all right. He's putting your hand through here now. <laughs> okay. All okay. right. All right. We Gucci. Well, if I make a face... Don't judge me. I'm, You're I'm fine. Judging you. I'm <laughs> I've been I've been watching Brave watching TikTok. Oh, that, that ain't, that ain't ain't hair hair hair. I have no hair. I know what's going on. Shoot. Ten All right. So now that that's done, we got the updates out the way. Oh, I did have one last one last update uh, on anime for y'all, and that is boom. This one right here. My dress up, darling. New season, yes, sir. Coming out. If you have not seen it, you it's coming. So, uh, the wifey says hi, y'all. Hey, what, what up, Jay? Bay? What's up? Yeah, what's up, Doc? Uh, yeah, you gotta watch the show. The he, the dude in there, the main character is dope as hell. His granddad made dresses for dolls. And so he wants to go into that oh, career no, of making that. dresses for dolls, they right? They said, hey, I, like, I can and, hear them. <laughs> and this girl here is her classmate who I'm is in the cosplay. Kidding. She starts work. He starts working with her to make her cosplay costumes. It's it's lit. This. It's a great slice of life. It's a good. It's a good feel good. Um, if you like, if you have and seen the cosplays are dope as fuck. Wow. Oh yeah, definitely, definitely. If you have seen this and you're looking for something similar, you should watch Princess Jellyfish. Just a shout out to that. So, all right. Oh, since we talking about cosplays, uh, today's anime drip is Zoro, and we are sponsored by Water. Can't go wrong with Water. Gatorade. Another one can't go wrong with Ginger Ale. <laughs> a cup of ice Get going and the, on cup, the glass because today we are on Bacardi Gold, baby. Oh, a classic. Oh, 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 oh that's a classic. Nah, oh, wait, Panda. One more, one more slight news update. Um, yeah, go ahead. Okay, we got Maya Academia coming out next week. The episode count has been confirmed to be 25 this year, so just gonna throw that out there. 
my hero starts back so up the next it this year or going into 2023 no it comes out okay. this year so we got 25 going into i guess it is gonna go to next year i guess i'm not sure Let's but they doing like can, um i think it's i think they do maybe 13 then maybe maybe a week or two off then another 12 so i right, going to so pretty much the fall season pretty much but the episode count has been confirmed at 25 and not gonna lie, I'm kind of glad it's that high because of what goes on. I have a and I have a pretty good idea. I think I know where it's gonna end off. And as I've been saying, everybody who was bitching the morning about season five, you don't deserve what you're about to get. I'll just say that right now. <laughs> I'll say that right now. Let's just say all I say is if you remember Naruto's war arc, we're about to enter a war arc. That's all I'm gonna say. I'm gonna leave it at that. So if you remember Naruto's war arc, we're about to do something similar with my hero. So okay, okay. Well, so, as we'll see. Was. Gonna be some some people gonna get murked. Vocab, I did not say anybody dies. Since people gonna get murked, I didn't put it out there. That's already been written in stone. So don't say that. I know, I know, I know. Some people gonna get decapitated, and that's about it. And let's just say we gonna come out of season six. Y'all gonna be like, the oh, fuck. What's going on? By the time we finish this scene, I'm like, the fuck? That's all. That's all I'm gonna say. Because if you remember a certain panel I dropped in the group chat a couple of months ago, that's why I think season seven is gonna, season six is gonna end. Mm -hmm. Remember a certain panel I showed you of Deku? A yeah, months we back. know. Well, we do. They don't know. Yeah, I'm, like I said, I'm, 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 that's why y'all know because I want because I know how we these don't get back to because I know how these streets are and I don't want y'all to get spoiled by anybody else. I'm hey, trying to protect y'all. These streets is real out here, yo. I mean, y'all see what happened when Black Freezer yeah. came out? Some shit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, oh, the going, yeah. yeah, and funny, yes, and one last thing before we jump into, in case anybody was looking for Dragon Ball Super this month. Manga wise, they're still on hiatus, so we don't know if they're coming back for October yet. They still on break, but that's an Boruto is Boruto, and I'll leave it. At that. People, people just gonna we we'll touch Boruto another day. We'll just Boruto. throw those last two Are you all caught there. up? Yeah, Boruto, I'm caught up. Anime wise, I'm not caught up because I know where it's at. I'm just gonna let it. I'm just gonna let it build. Yeah. And hopefully by next week, I should finish part one of One Piece if my work, if my job is slow. I should probably be able to finish the end of part one. Okay, okay. All right. Well, yo, I know what we're we about to get into. I'm about to switch this up and get into D&D &D mode. Oh, we are D&D &D mode now. We about to we about to switch gears real quick. That boy Silk out here being a loner. So I I drink to that nigga Silk. <laughs> of course. <laughs> so uh make sure you got your apps up. You got your character mm -hmm. sheets up. You don't need those. Doing that right now. Oh, never mind. I had to change my name one. I second. never, I never get out of it. It just sits in its own tab. It just sits um, there. I'm so serious. <laughs> I will share my screen. Nigga. I got like uh, ten tabs that just don't ever move. I feel that. I feel and that. that is one of them. Yeah. What's the roll twenty? I gotta get that. Oh, wait, no, we don't need roll 20. Only, I'm bubbling. Oh, yeah, no, no, no. Don't worry about roll 20. I'll handle that. I know. Me. I did that. That was, that was on me. I'm just clicking stuff. Oh, you good. You good. Aren't they, uh, matter of fact, aren't they getting ready to mix, match, put them together? What do you mean? Uh, the D. Oh, D yeah, roll on it. Yeah, yeah, you, so, you uh, don't have to go to roll 20 no more. Maybe. That's what yes. saying. Uh, D and D Beyond is working on my D and uh, or sorry, one D and D is what it's called, where you can put like you as a token tool creator. It's a map creator. It's all of your all your stuff for your your content, your books, uh, generation of your campaign, all of that in one in one area mm -hmm. on D and D Beyond. Yeah. Uh, so I'm definitely looking forward to seeing what they do, how they do with that. Okay. 
Um, it'll be it'll definitely be an interesting interesting little ride. They are looking for people to try like test pilot pieces of it, uh, where at, where you can go in and do some updates and you know see okay well I like this I like this make comments and stuff like that. So feel free to let them know. Let them know, Cole. Alligator. This. I'm just pulling up what it, the last little things that I need as well for it. Actually, I don't think I need that right now. Uh, so for those who weren't here last time, uh, and to remind you all as well, last time uh, on Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> last time on Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> last time. Uh, Niggas in a podcast. <laughs> so we had uh, we have our characters we have Silk we have Jay Kaze and we have Jen Will Jen Will's the heir Jen- Genasi Silk Kaze what is he uh, um, Wizard Monk yeah Wizard Monk you, oh, you're the Wizard Monk right Jen yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. Um I gotta pull everything back up so I can read off y'all stuff as I'm going. Cause I need my characters. There y'all. Oh, I gotta work on that stat. I had to switch gears. All right, so we have Jay Kaze as a change from fighter rogue. Jen Will, Genasi, Wizard Monk, and Silk is an elf warlock rogue. Okay. Um, with that, they, they uh, <coughs> people who are the emissaries of the queen, I guess you would say is the best way to put it. They're emissaries of the queen, and they were sent out on a mission. They turned home, uh, of course, as they came through the gates. Silk goes straight to the brothel. And yes, sir. Quickly, yes, I did. Quickly brought back to everyone else because business come first. Yeah. Anyway, they were they know him there. They do know him there. It's like cheers for him. Yes. Um, they, Everybody knows so, my name. Shortly after that, the queen was gone. Everybody thought she was dead, and that the king, his punk self, was trying to take over. Oh, Donzo they, ass nigga. I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> right. They went to see the king and ended up in prison because the king was like, Yeah, I don't believe y'all. And he a fuck nigga, boy. He is. He is. So, <laughs> with that being the case, they planned a breakout. Of course, because, you know, it's these three, right? They yeah. Mm-hmm. They planned a breakout in their breaking of the out. Vocab or Silk, as he will now be known for the rest of the evening, decides to jump down the well with teleportation magic. Tis me. Just because of teleportation magic, he has no clue where he's going to end up, how he's going to end up, or why. But he jumps. Because I gotta be me. He gotta be him. He gotta be him. The other two pop the grate at the back of the room because they let the guard, all, all of them let the guard run out the front door to warn everybody. And no one wanted to take that route. So they went up the back grate, circled around, got into a, a slight little scuffle real quick and made their way out of the barrack room that they they came through. So to give you all an idea where we are. We're going to switch gears here. Hashtag blame vocab. No, stop. <laughs> Hashtag blame vocab. It is my fault. It is my fault. It is his fault. But I'm guess what? Lie. Silk out here being a loner, chilling. Guess who didn't have to fight? Nobody. Silk didn't have to fight nobody. Because Silk yeah. said, let's get the fuck out of the castle. And other niggas was like, oh, let's go through the castle. So, niggas is out of here, bro. I'm gonna show you a few things. 
And actually, I can't do this the way I want to because y'all get to see the full screen. So y'all get lucky this time. I'm going to figure it out for next time around. They get extra lucky, y'all. So don't blame me on this one if they, if they actually make it out alive. It was not my intent. Wait, who got lucky? Um, Good to know. <laughs> <laughs> Good to know. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, God, lucky. It was not my intent for them to make it out alive. Trust me, it was not. It really anyway. wasn't. He tried to kill us every time. Oh, of course, yeah. of course. It's my job. This is why I was like, yeah. I'm not going in the fucking castle because this thing we gonna try to fucking figure out a way to end us. Oh, that was that's not, you. Actually, you're you're the easiest for me to kill off right now, though. Yeah, but that's <laughs> just, fine. Just <laughs> That's <laughs> you are the easiest. Why are we blaming vocab money? Because he decided to duck off by himself. Damn right I did. Rule number one: you do not split the party. Any person who plays D and D knows that. Luckily for me, none of these <laughs> people play D and D. So this is gonna technically, be since I jumped down the portal first, I'm not the one who split the party. Dumb niggas split the party. They should have followed my ass. It's all about how you look at it, but I can see that perspective. I'm just saying, I did it first. <laughs> just like Ray J, you know? Oh, that's not he said, I did it first. <laughs> I'm done. Not he said like Ray J. I'm I done. Say- all right, so we will leave Silk. Uh, he, he showed up in a cathedral in a, in a, in a, on a room, on a floor with a light and a clock on it. That's right. That Whatever. was the last thing we saw. Not that clock, baby. What he saw. This is where he came. This is where he woke up right here. He woke up right in here. Okay? That's me over there. Yes, woke up. But today we are going to start off in the dungeon with them niggas. You have a D and D character. You, Monty, do you play D and D? If you do, we are always welcome to have extra people on the show. So I mean, if you want to jump in a campaign, I'm down. All right, so you basically, you guys just finished knocking off some people. Oh, yeah. Y'all came out the door. Y'all were coming down the hallway. You all find yourself, and I'm going to zoom in in here for you so you can see it a little better. You find yourself coming to this crossroad here, right? Looking through, you see three pathways ahead of you. Right, and then you go straight across. You do notice, Jay, see the guys right here down at the bottom, Mm. right? Okay. You see that dude there, and you see the head of someone else down here heading that direction. It's a nigga head. They are, you know, not running, but moving with purpose, if that makes sense. Right. Uh, What would you all like to do jay and jay kaze and jen you all are both standing there they mm. didn't catch you y'all came up to the corner after they already passed it well i would doing? say we got to avoid them because we already took a lot of damage from the last fight you i did, would say you, you have not healed yet exactly so it looks like they're going towards the right i would say take that upper left path on the top that's what i would say we go if they didn't catch way, us no, that way, right here. Oh, this way. yeah, that's where I would go. Break left. Okay, okay. Jay, what are y'all doing? You gonna follow his lead or what? Because we can't go right because they're gonna catch us, and then we have to fight again, and we're already kind of damaged. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Can Jay even hear us? Yeah, I'm gonna follow his lead. Follow his lead. All right, all right, all right. So y'all break left. Bye out. Get a left. Yeah. I'll start taking off running. <laughs> In my Kevin Hart run voice. Is that how they? Um, were? That was how they did it. They hit the hit. No, it's not <laughs> bad. Not bad. Okay. <laughs> right on. Right on. So as you guys are going, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna move this ever so slightly. Y'all start heading up. Let me open the, the gates here. Oh, my bad. That's the wrong area. Y'all was way too close to the edge. Hold up a minute, fam. 
Same position, but a different spot in the map. Okay, let me see it again. Uh, does it, I does it, y'all that right now. Now I'm talking about the position. Oh, okay. Never mind. That nigga said, none of y'all niggas get to see. Here. This is where you are. I apologize. Y'all are down here. You did still see somebody here, though. Like, you still okay. see these dudes that just ran past you. But the break is a little bit different. You got a door oh, okay. here. And you got this area here. Hmm. Did we see which way they went? They which went way did he go, George? Which way did he go? They went to the right. You okay. have left, and you have uh, you have this area here, and this area here. Hmm. You know what? Okay, if they're going away, I think they're going. I'm gonna. You know, I think I think I want to keep the same same thing. If they're going away, I'm yeah. So it's gonna stay left because I don't want to bump into them. I don't want to fight right now. Let's get some. Let's get some potions or something. But y'all run this way. Y'all out. Y'all run it. You get. I would say about a good ten. 20 feet and you start hearing voices coming towards you. Okay. Uh-oh. Hmm. You start hearing voices coming towards you. Hmm. This is what you see. Okay. Damn it. Now. I need a perception check from both of you. All right, perception. Okay, okay, that's one of my better stats. Okay, and then you gotta click on the number, right? Uh, yes, yes. Okay, so let me do that right now. Oh, nice. Twenty-two. Twenty-two. Okay. Okay. Jay, what you got? Yo, my tablet tried to update the app and it deleted it. Oh. Damn. Uh, Hold on, what's right. the website? For you. I got you. I'll roll one for you. If it's not a 20, I don't claim it. Too late. Uh-huh. It's a tw- it was 20 on the nose, too. <laughs> nah, yeah, it was a 20. It really was a 20, natural 20. So, hey. They made an update to it. I'm not a fan of this, though. I don't like this update. I don't. No, update? my tablet updated. No, 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 no. No, the oh. site updated. And I'm not a fan of how I did it. Oh, what's the site? The website, I forgot. Uh, uh so 20 was what you had that's definitely not a problem uh so 22 and a natural 20 so that being the case you before you get in view lot right catch. before they realize you're coming you catch wind of them. And I mean, if you think about it, you're an air genasi who is a master of the wind and air. Mm -hmm. You, you know, when the currents and flows of things don't feel right. 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 That makes total sense. You broke left. He was like, hold up. Wait a minute. It just wasn't, it wasn't vibing with you. You felt the footsteps and the rushing of people coming towards you. So you had a resist that little slight resistance. Yo, come get the ball. Stop running from it. Thank you. 
Came, came, the, the little 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 bit of resistance there, right? Mm-hmm. So you turn around, you you grab Jay's arms like, hey, yo, no, 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 no. We're going to go back. So you cut back, right? Okay. And then y'all duck because, you again, you don't want to hit the other people, as you said earlier. Right. So y'all duck across to the other room. All right? Y'all duck across here. Bet. Coming in, door closes. And these people I do need a stealth check though. Okay, stealth check? Okay. A stealth check for both of you. I'll go ahead and do your stealth check for you. Big bam. No whammy. Crap baskets. Six. Six. Damn, you're not very stealthy, sir. <laughs> Wind is never stealthy. It actually makes logical sense. Wind is not stealthy at all. You whoa. So you better ride on the wind. Not net 20, but 20 and a six. So with that being the case, Jay, he pulls back to the side, like, okay, I'm not about to get in this corner. He he ducks in the corner, puts his flatness against the wall. Jen is not. An assassin. He's not a bounty hunter. This is new to him. He's not used to (laughs) having to hide, right? He just he stays to himself. So you wait. Give me just a moment, and we're gonna see if they hear you as they go past. And there are four individuals. Nope. Nope. Oh, heck no. <laughs> and no, you make it. They do not. It's a Christmas miracle. <laughs> not hear you. They do not hear you. They, they bypass completely uh, and follow the other individuals that were going down the hall. Now, I'm assuming you all keep, continue to proceed down the hallway. Right. It makes you're... sense. We're, yeah, must okay. keep going down that same hallway. Perfect, perfect. So you all continue down the hallway. And as you go, you hear someone, you hear like the sound of chains moving, and someone says something. Uh, D. What's up? you say as you see two people run past your cell? Hey. <laughs> hey. Guys, let me out of here. Were those guards for you? Hey, guys. Mm, do that. I love it. Look. You all turn. And on the right side, of the wall, like as you came in, you know, I'm opening up a little bit more for you to see a little more so it's a little clearer. So, where Jen is right now, right on this side of the wall, right here, uh, if it, if it'll let me. There we go, ping it, ping it. There you go, ping. It. Right that shit, right? So, right there, you didn't even realize it, you just saw bars, right, as you were going through because it's still a dimly lit passageway. And you look in and you see a figure against the the back wall of this this opening, this this room behind these bars. And you notice now it is a locked door. Like it's a a locked door. Um, And you hear this voice coming from it. What what would your voice sound like, D? All right. All right. I get it. Hey, guys. So you hear this rather rattly voice. Not deep, not light, but just pained. Trying to get your attention. Okay. Are you the ones 
that these guards are looking for. How do you know? That's so wrong, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, How do you know? I won't lie. It's pretty obvious you guys are sneaking around. Well, I could try not to get caught. Sure, sure, and who are you? I'm a supporter, a supporter of the Queen. My name is Diesel. I was trying to find her, but the King locked me up in here. Hmm. I see. And how long have you been locked up in here? It's hard to tell time in here. Could be days. Could be weeks. I'm not sure. Got it. I mean, it seemed like, I don't trust you, nigga. <laughs> Mm -hmm. <laughs> someone gotta be the inquisitive one. <laughs> someone gotta be the inquisitive one. Nah, that's right. Nothing wrong with it. Remember, my character doesn't it's trust people unless he plays a game with them. So obviously, my character will be the more questionable one. Nah, you're definitely gonna be the most reliable that's one. Good, bro. We know it ain't me. Come on. Yeah, you teleport. Know. Yeah, you I teleport. No. You teleport. You teleport away from people. It's damn right I do. <laughs> you damn right I do. Okay. Why were you guys in the prison? Where were Same you as you. Mm -hmm. You guys are trying to find the queen? Yes, we are trying to find the queen ourselves. Because we had just came back from a mission and all of a sudden Queen's dead and we got thrown in here. Wait. Did you say the Queen is dead? At least that's what we've heard. Real quick. At the mention of that Diesel stands. He was sitting like you just saw oh, this in the back saying? corner. At the mention that the queen was dead, he rises, and as he does, you like, damn, this thing is big as fuck. Yes, yes, I know because that's <laughs> what you would do. You would definitely make this thing. This guy people. is literally a hulking giant. Yeah, you do shit like that. Fucking leave it to panda to just throw a random giant in the cage. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> Guys, listen. If the queen is truly dead, let me out. I need to avenge her death. Hmm. Could definitely use more. Cause we, any allies we can get at this point, nice smart. We're already down one man already. We're already down one man already. It sounds like we all have the same. Fuck it. I'm going to let him out. I was just trying to be dramatic. Damn. Because <laughs> <laughs> Jay is that dude. He's like, you know what? Everybody's doing. When I say everybody's playing this perfectly, this is amazing. I'm loving this. Um. Okay. So you let him out. Uh, I need you to give me a. Uh, do you do you have thieves tools? Uh, let me see. Do you remember it? Let me see here. Yeah, you do. I do. <laughs> right, the person with them ain't. But I'm not there. <laughs> okay, so you do have thieves tools. So I need you to roll a sleight of hand. Is your stuff back up? Who is that? She's cute. Sleight of hand. Who me or? Uh, no, him, because he's picking a lot. Oh, got it. Jacuzzi. Yeah. 
15. 15? Simple enough. It's an old lock. I mean, it's sturdy. But you, you know, you fiddle your way around. It's like, eh, 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 pop. Lock open. As you do, you see these large gray fingers reach. Ooh, the ooh, not large gray fingers. And push it open. And as he ducks down to come out, you, you see it. what is in essence an elephant. An elephant? That's humanoid. Human it's a loxodon by race, is what they call. Oh, so he um, was Kaido. Yeah, right. <laughs> he was Kaido. Right. <laughs> Kaido's not an elephant. He's a fucking dragon. No, the animal pirates. No. Right. Oh, my God. Well, Jack. Shut up. You know about Jack? The mammoth nigga? Basically like Jack. No, but he literally is an elephant, though. Like, he, he's not human. He's just a, he is a big elephant with human. He stands as a, as a human He's got fingers. He's got, you know, saying you would assume toes. He's got boots on right now, shoes on. But he walks. He see. He comes through the door, and I mean, what do you say from there? What's the name of this nigga race? Loxodon. Is that right? You not there. Okay. <laughs> you not there. You <laughs> I know, but you said you said it, and I I didn't I like did. hear it properly. Yeah, it, Loxodon. Loxodon. Right. I know I'm not there, nigga. I'm a loner. <laughs> Thank you. You may, you have to you you may not know it when you meet him, so you might have to roll. Hey, shit, I might. My name is Diesel. You won't regret letting me free. Good. I believe you. Nigga. Just make sure you won't regret us letting you free. That too. True. We some gangster ass niggas, bro. But you can't see me. Right? Vocab, you are not here. Shut up. I just said that. <laughs> like I said, we are one man down. We do need one. We do no, need extra man. At this I moment, said that. Jesus, mm-hmm. a familiar tug in the back of your head causes you to look at Jay. And you see tucked in his side the pair of black gloves that he took. He's not wearing them. He's not wearing them. But the pair of black gloves that he took. I'm wearing mine, though. Okay. You. Where did you find those gloves? And I charge us that's a little further down from here. It was in the cellar, nigga. You know, church just in the room that we was captive in. Please. Those gloves are mine. I don't see they have special on. properties. <laughs> they were taken from me when I was in prison. They allow me different spells, special spells that I can use to help us. Hmm. As for time school for and, and measures, I wouldn't. Oh, okay, Jay. I'll. I'll get got the gloves. Oh, Jay, just you being you as a bounty hunter, right? You you know how to take a measure of a man when you see him. I need you to roll the measure I'll of a you, man. I'll let you choose. You can do investigation or perception. Oh, perception. Go for it. I all If I can find it. You can't find it. Well, Kev, you're not here. Shut up. I know that, nigga. This is me being <laughs> a part of it. Nigga. Yeah, teleport yeah, away. Nigga. We the crew. Hey, y'all should teleport. First of all, I made it very clear on previous episodes that if I could have Sorry. a power, it would be teleportation. Nigga. Y'all yeah. should. I was gonna hear the word teleport and go, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> These are what these are these are facts. He, point, I mean, he did he did stay true to his character. I say it every time, bro. You you man of his word. Not with us. I am a man of my word. Bro. Time for drink number two. I wrote a four, man. 
<laughs> you rolled a four, so you really don't. You know, what? I think I heard you say that. <laughs> yeah, if you would shut up, you would hear. It's I dark. Do it's, it. it's, it's you mad? All you see is this big hulking beast of a creature with a long nose and big flappy ears. That's all you really see right now. Um, this nigga, do, you, do you give him the gloves? I say give him the gloves. We need as much help as we can get at this point. I wanted to wear these gloves. But I give him the gloves. I mean, you need to wear them, kids. But you give him the gloves, and Diesel, you slowly, you hold them, like, in two hands. You look at them. And you literally almost have a tear come out the corner of your eye as you hold them. And you slowly slide your hand back into them. Uh, Rod, give me a perception or yeah, give me a perception check. Perception check, that okay. Check. Got lost. No, wait, hold on. My bad. You good? Nice. Twenty three. Call me Michael Jordan right now. Twenty three. See. Okay. You. Okay. So. Jen, Jen sees, he, he, he sees, because again, it's dark, right? So he, he sees the little, like, almost tear in the corner of the wrinkle of the, of the, of the elephant man in front of his eye. Mm-hmm. And you also, as he, as he starts to pull, as he starts to pull the gloves over his hands, you notice they are scarred to hell. Like, well, his hands- they look like something got, sh- like, when I say removed it was almost like a layer of his skin got removed from his hands Dang. is how his hands look hmm. and you see him like just sliding the gloves back over and as they do you notice them almost disappear around his fingers what the gloves the Carson's, the, these are full glove gauntlets mind you gauntlets Oh, gauntlets. Think that's different. The tops of the fingers, the tips of the fingers, yeah, fade into his own fingers. You, they're they're gone. They disappear, and oh. you see these little metal studs appear right above his knuckles. Okay. okay. You see yeah, almost shit. like a velcro. Think of like a biker's fingerless gloves. Mm-hmm. With brass knuckles built into it. That is what what the gloves that you all thought were just these big black bulky gloves. That's what they turn into when placed oh. on his hand. And the other one does the same. Diesel in the back of your head, you hear Brother. Brother, are you okay? Uh, all right, Panda, can I – is this a telepathic link, or do I have to speak out loud? Yeah, this is telepathic. Okay. I think back. Now that we're together again, yes. Now, who the hell I got to slap up in this bitch? <laughs> That's not about right. I think – that's who we're going to find. Oh, good. Well, let's point 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 the way. Cause I'm about to sit up in here and we're gonna tear this new ass off. I'm tired of this. They even took me away. They didn't rip me off your head. Mind you, y'all hear none of this. This is in the back of his head right now. Back of that head. <laughs> and you all you see is a huge grin creep across Diesel's face. As he's just like, oh my god. <laughs> um, however, Diesel turns us and points you all. We got to go back this way, and he points you back the way you were coming. Not the way back. Go, ahead, go in the damn castle. All right, guys. The gloves are sensing that there is a portal back in this direction. 
Wait, what? Have you come across it? That's where we came from. We we that's where we came from. We didn't trust it, so we went this way. I jumped in that motherfucker. <laughs> Stay in your side of the portal for right now. Shut Listen, up. let me get a like y'all can't hear me, but nigga, I like making my little fucking comments. Nigga. Come on. <laughs> let me have fun. Okay. I know that you've just met me. And you guys have done so much already. You need to trust me. We need to go through that portal. Ooh, are y'all going to end up where I'm at or end up where I'm at? I do not want to go to that portal just because of okay, I went. And I didn't think the portal was a good idea right? because we didn't know where we were going to go. That could lead us right to the king's tomb and get beheaded. You might not end up next to me. Maybe. Now you have me. Yeah, there is nothing me. in that portal that can handle me. So I have a question. You got a lexicon, nigga. What about the other gloves? Wing issues. Honestly, I don't know anything about the other gloves. Yeah, because I got two of them hoes. I got the gold one and the purple one. Nigga. Okay. Well, at least we got your gloves. If you don't know about the other ones, we'll have to figure that out along the way. Okay, let's go back to the portal. All right. Uh, yeah, we got no choice here. I, I wow. guess uh, I don't, uh, I'm trying to conserve our power, but I guess we got no choice to go back Go back to the lion's head, I guess. Look at y'all. See, y'all should just call You know, I'm kind of glad y'all didn't follow me because then y'all wouldn't have met this Lexadon ass nigga. I can't hear Volker because he's not with us. I know. I'm just. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, so y'all man, all you viewers, don't ever leave your ace behind because he gets mad. Of course, of course. <laughs> so y'all, y'all go back and y'all look at the door and you listen. You know, what I'm saying ain't nobody else coming. Doesn't seem like, and you you open the door and you sneak around and you head the way all those people you just watched went. Okay, and. Move some stuff around here. Y'all get down. When I say y'all are inundated. Inundated ain't the word. Y'all see where the screen right here? Yeah. Up, blow it up a little bigger. I'm also going to move it out. So y'all were here, right? Right okay. here. Y'all are right near. Y'all go all the way down. You come down. Three of you. I got to get a, uh, a a marker for you, Jesus. But eventually sure. I'll have that. Y'all move all the way down. And you run into... Back into the room. That y'all came out of. What a drag. <laughs> that room right there, right? Right at the door. Right at the door. Before you walk into the room. You see. Everybody you watched go past you. All Are they the back in the room? Oh no, they were going to the room. Remember that one oh. guard ran. Okay. Remember that? Yeah. Yeah. I would say, don't forget there's two gloves that's still in the room. I remember that's what I'm going for. Mm -hmm. so, so he Can't hear you. I know, I'm just, you know, telling y'all in here. Where he is Jack? Stand up and hear me. Jay is here. Well, I'm saying y'all come around the corner, right? I'm actually going to use this for you for now. Okay. Bear, that's going to be you. So, y'all come around this corner. And as you, as he... Diesel's leading the charge. Like, 
When I say this man has no oh, cares, God. he gives oh, no cares. No like, problem. he's not worried about listening. He's not caring. He's literally just boom. So you about the whole fucking do something. That's what's oh, happening. Okay. <laughs> right. Like, I mean, the whole thing is just stop. Like, he barely fits through. Ain't nothing else going to go sidle past him. Period. You know what I'm saying? Correction. It's a little smaller, so one person can get past him. That's about it, right? He, he's a big dude. So, I break the corner, right? And he's coming down. What is the order behind Diesel, though? Who's is it Is it Jakazi? Uh, I'm coming on the tail end, and... um. Okay. I'm gonna have, we're gonna have um I can't think of your name. Rod in the middle. Rod in the middle. All right. Okay. All right. Cool. Hold on, what's your health, Rod? I don't know. Let me check. Sure. Looks like I'm at what 35, 35? I think my hit point should be lower than that, but I don't remember what it's supposed to be. Oh, uh, let me check you. Here I got Jay's at 33, Jen is at 35. No, that's about right. I yeah, you you didn't really take much because you like you hit them. They all went after Jay. Oh, like, yeah, that's true. Out, and then you came back, so you're full right now. Jay is at thirty three out of forty six. So even though y'all are even, he's not at full. That's what it is. Oh, gotcha. Mm hmm. Because Jay had more hip than y'all. That means that all right. So. You cut this corner, right? And you see all of these people staring y'all down. You got somebody with a crossbow, a dude with a sword, and a dude with a spear. We're screwed. And, and I say they gunning. Mm. Right. Jen, <laughs> Jen what, what, what's your, what was your reaction again, Jen? Oh, we're screwed. You're screwed. Keep moving his All so right, bet, bet, bet. So, and that, that's that's basically what it is. Like he's like, yo, we we about to get, we we about to die. Y'all got the Lexadon. Uh, yeah, guys, don't Diesel. worry. I got this. He runs in. He's I, like, didn't say, I didn't press A. Doom must have pressed A. You don't have your weapons on you right now, do you? Okay. Fair enough. You don't have your weapons. Um, however, you do have all your spells. Mm-hmm. And you don't have her spells right now. But you have your spells. Aha. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay. Wow. He has to go. Let's see. Number 12 is it's my dude. Let's see what I want to do. Okay. How my head like hurt right now? I'm sure. I would imagine so. All right. So you said I don't have her spells, just my normal spells. You have your spells, right? Right. Right. Okay. Okay. All right. Let me, and I'm in front. So, I have to say this for you. Mm-hmm. What you doing, dude? Uh, what do you want Anytime you go into something, you should have bonus action. I was gonna ask you to go grab some milk or something from the store. Real quick. Okay. You have what's so called rage. Cook. As a barbarian, I was gonna cook some red, only some rage. dirty rice and cornbread. And what vegetables you want? That's a that's a very good point. That's probably. Why are you shaking your head? Are you upset? Okay. Are you, am I aggravating you or something? Let's. Uh, I'm gonna go into rage. Y'all could have told me I didn't mute. I joined the conversation. I'm see. Why? I wanted to see what the order is. True. <laughs> All right, so you go into a rage. So you, how does that? You tell me, how does that look? How does it look for you 
going into a rage. <laughs> All right, old aura, do you turn Super Saiyan? Like, do we Diesel, do when he goes into a rage, there is there is a saw a little soft black aura that surrounds him. Okay, you see his veins. All whatever skin is showing, his veins are getting full. They're starting to show. You see his eyes glaze over. What color are they? When he goes into a rage, they go to black. Solid black. Damn. Okay. It's an elephant with black eyes, bro. That's scary as fuck, bro. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, with the veins popping too? Right. Okay, okay. To a rage. Um what do you what are you gonna do? What like do you wanna what attack do you wanna do? All right. So I'm unarmed. Come in, come in, huh? You can do an unarmed strike, which means you just swing. This nigga just say come on, man. Hey, it's work it works for Fortnite. Hey. <laughs> it, does. it works in Elden Ring also. <laughs> yeah. How how close is the closest person and to Fortnite. me? Fortnite. Let me see. Uh, they are within 10, 15 feet of you. So you can easily if you wanted to, like, you can move up. You can run in and, you know what I'm saying, do what you want to do. Do what you got to do. Man. All right. Uh, how many bad guys we got total? Uh, there are one, two, three, four, five. Cashers All right. in the back. Uh, we got the dude with the crossbow in front with the dude in the, the sword. There are the two in front. We got one dude with the spear kind of behind them, and then the two cashers are behind them. Okay. Not money. Thing. Let me go ahead and go to the guy up front. Okay. And I attack him. What's up? The guy with the sword? Sword or crossbow? Crossbow. Crossbow? Okay. Boom. Mm -hmm. So you run up to the dude with the crossbow. What are we doing? Yes, crossbow. Unarmed Liger strike. Bomb. Huh? Unarmed strike? Unarmed strike. Yeah. All right. So where it says uh, the plus five, mm -hmm. click on that or roll the dice for you. Oh, wow. Only got a seven. Oh, my bad. I'm sorry. Do me a favor. Before that, no, 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 no. That was a seven. You rolled a two. Darn it. Yeah, you missed yeah. it, my guy. Yeah, that's yeah. I'm like, plus that's five. Insane. And you made a sandwich. <laughs> um, I know. Yeah, yeah. Well, um, give me my gloves back. So much for the lexicon. <laughs> So you you met, yeah you definitely Rusty. Remember if you yeah he been, you know he's been locked up for a minute. Nah, did I lose, did I need to press something to go into rage on uh, this app first? I wanted, that's what I was about to double check real quick. Uh, scroll down. I was about to say I don't know if you went yeah. into a range. So in the actions area. Yeah. If you scroll down past. Mm -hmm. Your attacks and everything, you'll say unarmed strike, wild shape, and then bonus action to a two mm -hmm. fighting, and then rage. You'll see that. Okay. Spot. Click one of those. Gotcha. All right. So click that. That's one. Mm -hmm. um, okay. And you do have still, you, you normally would have a second attack. I think you only have one attack action right now. Yeah, you only have one attack action right now. So, yeah. You would have been able to attack a second time on your bonus action, but you but I used that for rage. Yeah, right. So that's fine. That's cool. You missed him. You swung. You miss. You come in. You know. You come in with it like rush him with a haymaker. Like man, I'm over this. Yeah, he's come to swing, dude. Just like he scaredly, he basically trips back because you would have hit him. Right. He was like, oh my god, oh my god. He's like, you know, big big raging elephant coming at me. He steps back. You miss. You swing. <laughs> Missed him. All right. At this point, they now know you're here. Because before, actually, no. You would have had advantage on that. Roll one more time. Because they didn't see y'all coming from behind. All right. Oh, they're facing the other way. Yeah, they were facing the other way. I forgot about that. They were going the other direction. You did forget about that. I definitely thought they was facing these guys. <laughs> God, I rolled a one. 
Yo, bro, exactly, bro. Yo, give, give me my gloves, bro. Give me my gloves, man. Bro. Give me Blame my gloves. Gav. So, so you swing again. You swing the first time, and he's just like stutter steps looking, and then he realizes you're behind him and like falls for it, and you like miss him completely. Like you when I say the rage in your eyes, if they were red, the amount of bloodshot that just would have pierced even knows. more would be like maddening to you. Cause you're you you've been locked up and you don't know how long. And no, the first part no, no, no. you see, you didn't even get to crush his skull. Like you were infuriated right now. <laughs> but they now know y'all are there. And so I need everybody to roll initiative. No, not you. You're not here. Oh, he said everybody, nigga. <laughs> you know that. Hey, where's initiative? At? I'm chilling, bro. I'm chilling. So at the top, under so if you look at the top, you got the strength, dex, constitution, all that stuff, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, right next to your under oh. proficiency, it'll say walking. It'll say proficiency and walking next to each other. Under mm -hmm. those, it should say initiative and armor class. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Look on the initiative one. What is happening? Mm -hmm. Initiative. Okay, I see it. Yeah, I don't see it. Wait a minute. Nat 20. 22. 20. Wait, that's a jump. Fine. I had a plus two. I see dexterity, strength, constitution, wisdom. Why? Wait, do I think the precision button? Wait, I'm confused. Oh, initiative plus two. Oh, is that what I'm supposed to click on? Yeah. Uh oh boy. Um an eight. All right. Diesel, what's yours? Oh, um four. Oh my god. Give me my glove, man. Roll for you click on it. Dang. Your rolls are horrible today, my guy. They they have are to roll. Horrible. Happens though, you said four. Four, all right. So, let me rearrange these for everything. All right, so hold it. Who had an eight? So I have an eight. That was me. Okay, gotcha. Okay. Uh, all right. So, top of the initiative order, Jay. You just saw this man who you just gave these gloves to. Swing and a miss. Swing and a miss. What are you under? Take my gloves back. Shit, my. Oh, no, no, no. let me keep the gloves. <laughs> <laughs> He's not using like, them. Pair. You had two pairs of gloves on you, though. You remember that? Yeah, you have one more pair. Oh, yeah, I forgot the other pair. Well, I had green. Yeah, green, green and black. Green, and black. green oh. right now. You had green oh. and black. I had purple black and the yellow. Yeah. And the blue and the red is still purple. there. You took so purple. Back, I'm get the red. You. No, I took two. I took purple and the yellow slash yellow. Gold, and I have yeah, yeah, one yeah. purple on one hand and I have a yellow on the other hand. And the other I two. hear something. It's something in the back of my head. It sounds like vocab is here, but he's not here. I'm not. <laughs> I was in the right, I'm on. just playing, bro. <laughs> um, I guess I'm going to attack because I can't have them coming at us now. All right. So who are you going after? Uh... The guy that he missed. The, okay, so do the crossbow. Yeah. Yep. Crossbow. What are you gonna do? Hold on. I gotta get to my attacks. I'll have y'all weapons, get... remember. Mm. I, know. Yeah. I forgot how to get to my attacks. Uh wait, I just have my spells. So I'm gonna probably be useless. Oh wait, no, maybe not. Y'all both got y'all weapons right on you. Mm-hmm. So I forgot how to get to my attack though. Uh, it should be under initiative. It should say actions. Huh? Under initiative, it should say yeah. actions. 
I'm the ignition. It does not say action. Remember, I'm I'm on the website. I'm not on the app. I'm on the website. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. It does not say action. Let's see. Initiative, armor, class, well, strength, dexterity. Yeah. Here, hold up. I'm going to show you real quick. Is this what, Tell me if this is what you see. Yeah, but well, mine's don't look like that. I'm on my tablet. Ah. Can you, do you have a, a desktop mode? Just look. Sorry. All right. Let me pull it up here. I see skills. Uh, so skills. <coughs> do you have a sec? Go, scroll to the bottom. That's it. Is there another? There's a button to go over here, or like a settings button at the bottom. What's over at the very bottom to the right? Very bottom. You talking about this or this? The uh, the oh, green. Yeah. Active. There you go. Yep. Okay. Um. Let's see what I want to do. I guess I'm gonna tackle my long sword. Long sword. Okay. I just wanna rolly, rolly, rolly. With a dab wrench. With a dab wrench. Heck yeah. So well, roll for long sword. Roll for long sword. Oh my freaking god, six. Six. Y'all <laughs> niggas are trash, bro. <laughs> no, bro you make Dude, this I'll big never leave me y'all again, bro. No, you, you make this big force. You jump over. You're like, you know, forget this. You brush past him, push him to the side. Yeah. Swing, clink, clink, clink. Dude looks at you oh, like. Crying, no, bro. What's your do for the second round? Oh, y'all are trash in this dude. <laughs> You gonna do short sword or what? Hmm. Eleven. Okay, that's better. <laughs> it hits, but it just like grazes his chainmail. No damage done. Damn, no damage. So yeah, that was a miss. Eleven was a miss. All right. So next in the initiative order. Out of minute, let me get that pull back up. Uh, the wizard in the back. Come on, Rod. <laughs> All right, let me see what I got here. Come on, Rod. You gotta do something. You gotta wait, my guy. All right, I'm. Wait. I'm trying to think because I'm because I don't have my weapons. I'm trying to think where can you. You do have, have, your, we have our weapons. Oh, we have our weapons. Oh, yeah, okay, no. weapons. we got ours for we love. Yeah. Oh right, shit. You got the staff and shit, bro. Oh, okay, then bad shit. All right, I'm. Well, shit, we need some help here. All right, then I will do if I if I have my weapons and stuff. I'll do green. I'll do the green flame. It's not your turn. <laughs> The mage in the back, God, now man, seeing this, has kind of caught his composure and everything, and is like, oh, okay, cool. So are we doing this? All right. He spins out. <laughs> uh, he is going to cast Magic Missile. Magic Missile? Ooh, magic Missile. Hmm. That sounds dope. I ain't gonna lie. You can play at that game. Legit. Um, what kind of magic? Though? All what of a magic? sudden, you see, you see his hands kind of rotate around, Ooh. and then his fingers, as they Ooh. come together, he just like flicks them at you, uh -huh. and three different darts of missile. Did he just agora us? I was just that's what I was like, nigga, wait a yeah. minute. <laughs> Did it's called it's called magic missile. So yeah, I have that move. Uh, Rod. Okay. Well, I said I want to change some magic missiles too. Nigga. What is uh? I wrote an eleven. Is that match your armor class or is it lower or higher? Oh, my armor class. My armor class is a fourteen. Okay, so it misses you. Uh huh. Um, Jay, uh -huh. seventeen. What's your armor class? Seventeen. 
I didn't hear you. 13. 13. So that one hits. And Diesel, armor class? 16. All right, 13. So that one misses. So. Dang, Jay, you only nigga got in and Kareem flying <laughs> around everybody. You you like sidestep just in time seeing it because the air currents and everything. You feel the airflow of this missile come at you. You sidestep. It's like, oh shit, okay. It hits your, hits right where your foot just was. Your little explosion hits the ground. Uh for diesel. You see it coming at you. You just stand there looking at him like for real, fam. That's what you're gonna do. You take your truck and just and blows it off the course and it just starts. Flying, it hits the wall next to you. Jay, on the other hand, you still hit. thinking about them two misses you just did. Yeah, you didn't really realize what was I coming. I want to see out. my ace, man. Come on, what's going on there, bro? So, you you rolled it. He he catches you full body, bam, mm. full body, and you Wait, take. Let me catch the right. Get the right dice out here because I gotta. You know, a little bag here. Got to dump everything. Ugh. I wasn't trying to kill all y'all at one. I had to save my, save my dice for vocab. Yeah. Please do. Right, you take five points of damage. Five points of damage. Oh, right. I'm at 28. 28? Okay. Cool, 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 cool. The, the other... Other mage, seeing that the first two missed one and the other one hit, he's like, you know what? I I, I don't have time for this. I, I don't have Forty-one time. shots. Huh? He cast a mage. Actually, no, no. He casts a spell. You see his hands flicker. He casts a spell, and that's it. His turn's done. Right, you, he he nothing cast. happens. Nothing comes after you. You see him cast a spell with his hands. You see him muttering something under his breath. Oh, uh, the javelin though. He's like, oh no, forget this. I'm coming. He turns around. The loxodon was right there. He's like, you know, he's going to be a big He's going after you. And rolls a two. So the spear comes at you. And you just stare him down like really little man. And the spear just like not man. little man. <laughs> the spear just misses completely and like hits by you. And you look at him like I'm killing you next. Like you just got that look in your eyes, right? Um so that that's his turn. He missed. The dude with the crossbow who was just dealing. Just got attacked by um by Jay. He got attacked by both them niggas. Hey, this man got ultra instinct, bro. Right <laughs> this man got ultra instinct. <laughs> that nigga, he got to do something because both them niggas came he, after him. <laughs> he also was like, "No, nah, I'm about to shoot him dead to rights." Right? I to got you, bro. Niggas trying yeah, to kill nah, you. He, he rolled it too. So <laughs> he tried to shoot him with a crossbow, oh, yeah. point blank range. He's like, oh, "I'm gonna end him." He, he he like Jay's like yeah I'm 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 thinking about this but I'm not stupid and he's just like moves his head to the side and the bolt just like flies left right um so that's everybody the dude with the sword who hasn't been he's just sitting there like can you show me? Right, yo, look y'all yo, we ain't got time for all of this so mind you he came up here and tried to hit you he missed dude with the sword is like all right you know what. Forget this. He goes running. Do, 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 do. Comes at Jim. Does a... Does a 10 hit? Let's see, 10. What's my... Uh, my armor class is still 14, okay. so... 14, so no. He comes, takes a swing at you. Shoot! <laughs> Thinking he is the, he thinks he's just all that, right? He thinks this sword, he does this flourish with it and everything. Like he's going to be the next captain of the guard. He swings down and you just sit there looking at him like, I'm sorry, were you, were you swinging that at me? The wind itself just like moved it to the side. It was almost like he was swinging at an air image of you. Type deal, you know what I mean? Like, oh, like an like, air, like an air, like an air shadow plume. 
right like you you miss me completely my guy what is this what are you doing so so that that ends his turn uh jen it is now your turn and you oh. have the dude right in front of you with the sword plus the other four of oh okay so let me see what tech of action hmm hmm can I do a, wait? Do I have an attack that does multi strike that has multiple targets? Uh, let's see here. Because a multi attack seems like a good I idea mean, right about now. Not really at the moment. I mean, you have friends. That's for one person, though. Gust is, is not really that big. Gust of wind. It's gonna move everything in front of you though, including your people. Okay, now we don't want to switch positions. So I mean you can do that if you want. Now nah, we well, you can always move too. You have movement. You have movement. Like you're back here right now. So if you want it, you can move past. However, if you move past him, he gets an attack opportunity because you're coming out of his combat range. Oh, yeah, no, we don't want that. Okay, we don't want that. Okay. So how about hmm? Let's see, because I'm thinking two things. Maybe I can use a spell or hmm. Let me see the position again. I'm thinking two things here. Hold on. Let me see. Wait a minute. I think I, I think that's something like broken air that you can use. You know what I'm saying? Like you have those things in your key points. I don't know how many key points you got left. No, because I'm thinking, huh. What about the don't I have like a buff ability where I can buff people? Here's the, shot. Here's the shot. You got your stuff. You can you can do your stuff. Oh, okay. You, no. for you right now, but not for everybody else. Damn. Okay. Okay. That's what I was thinking. Maybe we could buff somebody else, but I guess that's not gonna work. Um, no, you need to buff the damn Lexadon. Buck spike, bro. <laughs> Buck spike. <laughs> All right. So then, at this point, hmm. ain't got no clerics in this squad. <laughs> Be I could this. probably be sneaky and do. Hmm. That right, I need nothing. you to do something, bro. Ain't nobody doing nothing. I know I'm trying to think. Should I go? There's a ghost because oh. vocab is not with us. That's all right. Hmm. The and we have our weapons too, right? We yeah, have yeah, yeah, yeah. You two do. He's the only one that doesn't because he y'all just broke him out of jail. He got uh, his gloves though. He got his gloves though. Yes. All right. The way I'm thinking is, hmm. what's stopping me from using the other gloves? I told you to pull them shits out. Did okay, you, you didn't put them on last round. Last, no, you didn't. You got them green. I don't want to cut them. Pull everybody out the way. Got got a good position. All right, then I'm gonna use. Okay, I was gonna use Gus, but I don't want to blow everybody away. We have, seems like we have a we're in a feasible spot right now, so I kind of want to take advantage. Yeah, it's, of it's, it. a, it's a tunnel, so if you hit it, everybody. I mean, don't get me wrong, you can do it, and then like people still have to make their like their saves, right? They could make the save. They may take a little bit of damage. They may take all damage though. <laughs> don't kill me, Rod. That's what I don't want to do. <laughs> That's right. what I'm trying. To... So you know what? I'm gonna keep this on the safe side here. You also let me activate my things. let me That's activate my green flame blade and just go go ham on somebody. Okay, go ham, right. nigga. That's what I want to see. Let me see that. Let me There's use the green right flame blade on the yeah the closest one to me. Green flame blade. All right, you what we got, what we got. roll that bitch. All right. Oops. Wait. What am I? Why well, gotta be a bitch though? Come on. Let me get some good, bro. Negative. Uh, so green flame. So here's the deal. green really flame, flame milk. It just activates, right? What you gotta do is roll the d20 like you're doing a regular attack swing with your with your deck. Okay, so I gotta click the the name. I gotta click the name for this thing here, right? So click the on the dagger. Do the hit the roll for the dagger. Okay, the dagger. Okay. Yep. All right, so I'm gonna roll it right now. Oh, 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 oh. I'm gonna get a. Crap, one of those hit 14. Like 11. I got 11. I thought it was gonna hit that. Yeah, those now, 11. So, uh, let's see. What's the uh, his DC was not 11, so you missed. Damn, on that. Everybody okay. missed. 
Do you have? Let's see here. You don't have. Yeah, you only got one attack. Now you do have your bonus action though. You can do a bonus attack though. You better do that shit, nigga. That all right? Well, oh. so for a bonus action. Hmm. No, no, actually, no. Correction, take that back. You can only do that if you actually hit. So you, you, that was it. Damn. Swung at him and you missed. You cast it. You cast the green flame blade. It's a cantrip though, so all it does is it goes on top of your blade, right? It's not like its own thing. So it goes on top of your blade. Mm-hmm. So you missed that attack. He was still, you know, saying mad about flaunting, and he just kind of ducked back, like, nope. "Oh, he missed and it. one of these." So, now, Diesel. Yeah. Your turn comes back. Come on, Lexadon. You. No. The amount of rage you have right now, right? When I say the amount of rage you have right now, is. I don't know an exorbitant amount of rage. It's the only word yeah, I can think use. Me. Right? You want me to take you <laughs> on me? Can... You have an exorbitant amount of rage right now. Yep. Um, Very nice. There's some juice, like some white, a big juice. You hate. You loathe. Could... These individuals in front of you. Mama, and kick your ass. You just found out that your queen who holds a very special heart part with you is dead. You were reunited with your sister, which is great. But in you all running down the hall, sis reads your memories as she's known to do because you know how black sisters are. <laughs> they don't like the no, little brother to be hurt. They don't. They don't like the little oh. brothers being hurt, right? Oh, I so do not know. Any pain point that pops up, she gonna read it. Leandra screams in pain, agony, and frustration in the back of your head. She's what? Oh hell no! Oh hell no! Uh oh! Your hand starts to rise on its own. Ooh, magic and hand! Stained down the hallway. Yeah. Grab Jay with your other hand and move him behind you. Jay, you've been pushed by big people before, right? And it takes a lot to do that. You're not, you're not just as a changeling, you know, most people think you're like small, you know what I mean? Like, uh, no, no, no. Like you're, you're a sturdy guy, especially when you want to be. When I say this man literally grabs you, your head pops between his first two fingers and his second two fingers. He just places them on your shoulder with your neck between the middle of his hand grips you with this pinky and index finger linking under your armpit and just moves you to the side and lets you go while this hand is constantly reaching forward towards everybody else in front of them. The fact that you just letting this man man handle me like that, I don't like that. I'm trying to tell you. No, 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 trust me, trust me. It ain't him right now. <laughs> I promise you that. The nice. eye, we don't know that. You don't. You don't. You're very exactly. right. You so he thinks he's being mad. However, when you look at him, give me a perception check. On oh, me or him? You. You give me a perception check, Jack. Okay. Hold on. Let's have it with the sleep perception, perception starts with a P. Nat 20. When I say you 
have been scared of very few creatures in real life. Right? Very few. Like, you can name on one hand. When you look up at his face, the black that was his eyes, that you were like, oh, okay, he looked like he about to do something. The black has now bled into his veins of his face. Up his into face his, like his forehead, through his cheeks. So this nigga Venom. Right. Yeah. To the point where they're starting to crawl down his trunk, this elephant's trunk. Like, you ain't been scared of a lot, yeah. but this man just hit your top six <laughs> in that instant. Nigga, scary, bro. From your mouth, Diesel, you hear the combination of your voice and Leandra's. We are Venom. <laughs> no! No, we are Laxadonis. Hey, my queen. You had the audacity to believe that you are worthy. You will all die. And in that moment, you see every person in front of Diesel grasp their throat. So this nigga Venom and Dark Vader, damn. Yeah, nigga, he got the force. And symbiosis. Black veins creeping from their hey, mouth. You, you see how Penna do his aces. Down their veins to their throat. Nah, listen, this is because y'all niggas was so trash. Panda had to help y'all niggas. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I, I can't wait for him, him to kill you. I can't wait for him to kill you. Yep. And then you see, because you rolled a nat 20, you see Diesel's face. Wait, a nigga rolled a 20? Yeah, I rolled a 20. Hey, I'm so proud of you, Ace. He comes back, he comes back to normal. Eyes no longer black. What color are your normal eyes as Lux and I, Duran? Brown. Brown, normal brown yeah. eyes. All the veins are gone. The people in front of him, though, no, they did. Yeah, they look like they're seventy-five right now. Damn, nigga, not seventy-five. Oh, so, yeah, Tom was so right he's ven- oh, wait, wait. So he's venom. He's Vader, and he's uh overhaul. I'm gonna overhaul. Sugar yeah. Rockers. Yeah. Okay, wait. First off, though, I need to clarify: is are they? Black 75 or are they white 75? <laughs> white 75. What do you think? Damn. They're... Because there is a difference. No, black don't crack. That's They're right. white 90. You know, look at Damn. James Old We just seen this picture earlier. What do you think? They look about 130. You see what I'm saying? Like, okay. when I say shriveled beyond Maybe. compare. Not Earthworm Jim in the face ass niggas. Not even Earthworm got more from it. Why are we here, vocab? <laughs> because Good point. You can't get rid of me, nigga. We, so, you you got rid of yourself. I I did yeah. not. Y'all yeah. niggas didn't follow. You should have followed suit. At Aren't that moment, they fall to their knees. I love you, Ace. And during that, Diesel just walks through them. He goes to the door of the dungeon, the the dungeon room. Opens it and goes back like y'all coming. Yeah, we come. Yeah, okay, we the dungeon room. I'm so proud of y'all niggas for making it to the dungeon room. Rob, go go shut up. up. Blue gloves, nigga. Rod, not Rod. Go no cap. Shush. Don't make me mute you. Nigga. Don't make me mute you. <laughs> Panda, do I know where my equipment is? Oh, uh, you in a second, we'll get into the room. But yeah, okay. What are y'all doing though? Y'all just watch that happen. There's still a guard out there next to Jen. Oh, they know him. Jen. <laughs> what are y'all doing? I'm gonna help Jen. Excuse me. Uh, the turn order because he's still out there. Return order is Jay. I'm gonna help Jen. What do you want to do? Uh, I'm gonna tackle with a crossbow. Okay. 
you turn. I'm not even gonna make you roll. You turn to look at this man. What? Oh, I had already rolled. Never mind. Don't take that. Don't pay that attention. Uh oh. <laughs> so you turn and you's like, okay, okay. Well, this just happened. I guess I gotta continue. So you turn and level your crossbow at this dude. When I say he is already ghost white in the face, like he even peed his pants. He don't know what's going on. And he just falls to the ground, faints, and just poof, falls to the ground. Mm. Y'all do what you want as to this point. Like the 75 year olds are sitting there, like, oh, I need my Viagra. They, they can't do nothing right now. So they need insulin shots and stuff. It, it, it's mm. a problem. So y'all going to the dungeon room? Yeah, I guess we got no point. I guess that's we have no choice at this point. We want to just keep going. All right, might as well. Room. You, it is easy for you to find your your equipment, uh, Diesel. It, it was okay. the same spot it was on this, like on a, on a shelf. Um, so you find that. Let me pull this up here. Okay, there we go. So you find you find your equipment. I go to the chest and grab the gloves. You go to the chest and grab the gloves. So the last two gloves were left. Uh, purple. Red and blue. You're wearing green right now. I haven't put them on yet. No, no. You're wearing green. That's what I'm saying. No, not wearing. You have green. You took green and black last time. There are red and blue left. Now. Mm -hmm. uh, Diesel. Mm -hmm. As you walk in, sure. as, you, as you're getting your equipment, can you give me a perception check? Sure. Uh, perception. Mm -hmm. All right, I got a 12. 12. Okay, starting to get better. Uh, Jen, you give me a perception check. Okay, perception check. Let's see here. All right. Yeah. Where's my perception? Big bucks, no whammy, and stop. Oh, I like that. 25. Huh. Nice. That's now, you've been on the before, right? And you 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 looked around. You you knew you saw everything that was in here. <laughs> However, in the back corner, right about here, where the other iron maiden is. Y'all wasn't really trying to deal with that, right? Because it was it was an iron maiden. Y'all trying to get out, right? True. This time, though, you came in, and now that the threat is gone, you see there's a creature in it. There's a creature in uh, the Iron Maiden? In the Iron Maiden. Oh, my God. Monolith, uh, like a stone statue of a being. Hmm. Inside the Iron Maiden. Because why not, right? Do you know if yes. everybody else would be just... Is it, is it Stitch? Is it Stitch? <laughs> so I want to play Stitch. Very good. I thought it was Lilo. Yeah. Do you? What do you do? Well, yeah, well, we, wait. We can't. No, it's still in statue form, so we have no way of waking it up, right? It's just a statue. Yeah. Hmm. Well, I said if we're gonna go through a teleportation portal, I guess we're gonna throw it in there and see what happens. They could be a test dummy. Okay. So you walk up to it and try to pull it out? Yeah. Why not? At this point. You walk up to it. Diesel, I'm assuming you're getting your weapons? Yes. Okay. Uh, Jay, you said you were getting the other gloves? Yes. Okay. Um, Jen, as you walk up to the other um, as you walk up to the, the Iron Maiden and you look at it, it is a stone-like the best thing I could describe it is the thing. Okay. But not as bulky. Right? About Ooh, the Digimon? Uh, no, the uh, thing. Like, Marvel thing. Or, uh, yeah, 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 Marvel thing. Okay, the thing is a rock monster. You said it's not bulky. Right. It's a Digimon that's not bulky. That's a rock thing. 
I, what's the name? I forget the name. I forgot. Yeah, I forget. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I'm trying to see. I'm trying to Probably, but like six foot, he's just not bulky, right? But he's he's made of rock. Clearly, it's a stone like substance, right? Um, Geo dude, great. He's gray in Gatsuman. Gatsuman. Yeah, got, oh well, leave Gatsuman alone. <laughs> no, don't leave him alone. Gatsuman. I got it right here. Gatsuman, no. Oh. I tried. You did. I was gonna name him Stitch. I know. No, no, no. No, he's like six foot five. Stitch is six foot five? No, no. The the creature oh, you're like, looking at is like six foot five. He's a think of like an android, right? Andromon. Stone stone covering instead of steel. Oh golem. What it looks like. Oh, giant soldier of stone. Yeah. Yeah. Jay's gonna name all the Digimon. Yeah. Hey, I didn't even give you a Not cobblestone, right? But like they're precisely cut, but they're stone slabs. You don't see wiring though. You just see stone, right? Like it's a, like it's a creature of stone. As you walk up to it, what do you? How do you get it out? Hmm. What do you do to get it out? Let's see, to get it out of there. Hmm. Lose levitation. So we're trying to break it out of the stone. No, 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 no. Like, the creature is in the Iron Maiden. I'm saying, what do you do to get it out of the Iron Maiden? Oh, we got to break the Iron Maiden, obviously. Break. Well, it's open. It's open. He's just in it. So we got to get him out. Uh, yeah, yeah. You said you were gonna throw him down the well, so I was like, "That's why I was like, how are you planning on getting him out?" Oh, I was gonna throw the whole thing down there. That's what I was thinking. <laughs> the whole Iron Maiden down? Why not? You going How you gonna do that? Like, you got a little bit of a distance to drag it over, fam. Oh, yeah. You gonna carry? What about you? What if I use my wind magic and push it over there? I mean, you you got a couple spells. What you looking like? What you trying to do? Okay, let me see what we got here. I mean, I got my gust spell. I can use that to try to push it across. Gust is a cantrip. It's not going to do anything. Damn. I'll tell you that right now. Gust of wind could move something, but I mean, again... If, if you know what God Jill level of that thing... You said God Jill? What God Jill level of such. It's level so sad. That level of sad. When God Jill level of such. Hmm. I don't know. I don't think I gotta get him out of there. And I doubt I can use any of my spells to break the stone open. You have levitate. Oh, you can oh. Up to five bro! I literally just said, "Well, God, you will Yeah, I know. Yeah. Okay. Well, all right. We'll use levitate then. Okay. Okay. So, cast levitate. Did you mark off a spell? Oh uh, yeah, I'm trying to look for the spell now. Oh, it spells. Levitate. Wait, where is Levitate? Tank magic. Oh, level T. Okay, level T. All right, I'll use it. And I think I cast it. I'm not sure. How do wait? How do I cast it? Wait, I go back to action. Um, what's action? Yeah, on actions. <laughs> No, you should be on spells. Okay, spells. All right, gust of wind. The one the side did what? So at the top above spells, above second level, mm -hmm. there are a couple of dots. Okay, hold on. Let's see here. Oh, you don't have. No, you can just use it, it looks like. Yeah, you can just use it. All right, so it's, it's a character feature. So, so I, so you can just use it. All right, so how do I do that? I just hit the spell. No, there's, no, there's no reason to click anything because it's part of because you're an air genasi. You can just do it. 
So it's not oh, like okay. a spell you have to do. You can just do it at any point. All right, then let's do it. Let me. How do I? Okay. Well, let's no, levitate. Saying, you don't levitate? We're doing levitate. I'll, I'll cool. do levitate. It don't move. Oh, shit. Uh oh. Which means it's more than 500 pounds. Yeah, that's However, heavy. um, do a perception check for me. All right, perception. Okay. Mm -hmm. Some, something I'm sniffing right here. Hopefully get something good. Big bucks, no whammy, and stop. And what did I end up with? It's Hold on. Try. I didn't even see it. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah, yeah. 14 is enough. Uh, remember, 10 is average. 20 is like immaculate, right? 20 is like perfect, and then immaculate's above that. So, um, 14 that's a, that's a good it's like above average and it's not hard to see what 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 happens the instant you cast the spell on him you notice from the ground which is normally where you cast levitate is like the bottom of something right from the bottom up you see these blue lines very circuit like weaving themselves up the body and these blue lights, just like LED lights, just start like bleeding up the body of this creature. Random in random random spots. Like it's not all in one area. You know what I mean? This is like just like a little, you see a little web and it disappears, and then you see another blue line come somewhere else. And it weaves its way all the way up until the lines finally come up and touch the eyes. And then the eyes light up completely blue. I, 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 mm. I, hello. Who, mm -hmm. who, where, where, where I, where I, I, I where I, where, 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 who, you, I. Okay, I am Jinwo. We have here the Kazuji and Jin 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 That's that's fine. Hi. I am I Jin. Uh I know. Uh um and it you see his take try to take a step and it like the foot comes up and as it comes down it almost buckles at the knee as it comes down but it almost falls and you you don't know if it's coming at you or falling what do you do hmm. sounds like he's trying to get his bearings together i would just i would wait it out personally okay so you take a step back yeah, I'll just take a step back, give him some room. Okay. He, and he, he, he does. He, he just kind of he puts his foot down, he reaches out and the speed that that hand cuts out though, and grips the outside of that Iron Maiden, that grip broke every piece of needle, metal, muscle, everything, and caught himself. You hear the metal wrenching in his grasp when he did. I, I, I mm, you hear the servos slow down. Hmm. Here, sorry, I am here. I, Jen, and he points with the other hand and steps out and like fully stands. And it seems like whatever motor programming was trying to happen has configured itself. At this point, you are not the guards. Have they left? Mm. And he's just looking around, mm. waiting. Hmm. I don't see no guards around. 
but we gotta to try to help him out at least. So while well, we're here. He's asking you, he says I don't see the guards. Oh, have the guards. Left. They have what we dispatch them. We got they're no longer here. There was something here that they went after, and we came back because we were trying to avoid what the guards were after. All right, now at that point right there, we're gonna take a quick break. You were right about 15 minutes, 10 minutes, 10 minutes school. Okay. Yeah. Right. 10 minutes. We'll do a quick 10. Yeah. Everybody re-up and then we'll be back. All right. Okay. Cool. All right. Cool. No, just a 10 minute break. Think we'll finish it up. Yo, that was the longest vocab was quiet the whole time. Yeah, oh, did I say that out loud? Oh, yeah, sure, dear. No problem. Take a Go to the and do your thing. I would. Yeah, yeah, yeah.
All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're we're still on break right now, but I just wanted to throw some things at y'all while I'm doing that, uh, while breaks up. We're, we're uh, still- we had a bit of an update with some things that can bring this away real quick. The Shibuya Art Hey, yo, Diesel, I think you're yo, your mic. Oh, my bad. All right. So, well, we've had this. I figured I'd throw this in. I know we're still on break and everything, but uh, this just popped up. We want to see that work for JJK2 when it comes out in 2023 in two segments. Okay. So, mm-hmm. yeah. okay. Yeah, that's going to be love. Oh, yeah. So, this is going to be an interesting, interesting thing. Um, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. I'm just trying to like look at a few things as I'm going through, see if there's anything additional. 
that we need to update. Yo, so oh. randomly, I had uh, my daughter's. Uh, she had a birthday party for her friends that she went to, mm-hmm. and it was a skating party. And I've been you know, I've been drink since I was little. You know what I mean? So we was like high, no, not little, but like high school. You know what I mean? I ain't really been. Uh-huh. Drink. And in uh, St. Louis, in the Missouri area, Illinois area, the rinks, well, I grew up in Indiana. And so our skating rinks had islands in the middle of the skating rink, right? Where there are seats in the middle of the Mm -hmm. island. DJ booth was in the middle of the skate floor. That's right. That's right. So dance floor, it was a raised dance floor behind the DJ booth, next to DJ booth. For people to skate on the dance floor, like on that raised platform, or just to really just go up there and dance, and then there was like skating in the island in the middle of the skate rink, as well as on the outside of the skate rink, right? And so it was like they don't have that here. They just have the skate floor. It's an open area in the center, right? It's just, it's like taped off. But it's like an open, you know, so it's just an oval in the center that no one goes into. Mm-hmm. And seating around the outer wall of the skate floor. For us, when we skated, like the outer wall was where you don't stand. We don't want nobody on the outer wall because that's where, like, the actual skaters, like the OGs, that's what they did. They thing, you know what I mean? Like right. they went against the wall, the feet was kicking the wall and stuff as they was doing it. You know what I mean? Like. There was nobody on the outer edge of everything. Right. And it was just interesting to see the difference from state to state on how how that skating rink was. That was interesting to me. Uh Vo, how like how are y'all like y'all stuff down there in Florida? I was gonna say so down here, the skating ring is one whole ass floor, right? There's nothing right. in the middle, it's just a straight up floor. You could skate the whole fucking ring. Uh-huh. The seating and shit is on the outside, but not like on the outside in the ring. Like right, not on the outside, wall, on the outside, outside of, the of the wall. Right. Yeah. Like the wall and then like outside where the lockers and shit is at. Right. Is where you got seating and shit. Then there's like a concession stand. Uh-huh. And then there's another separate room mm-hmm. where the DJ is at. Uh. And then there's like a area like you could dance and shit. So like if you didn't want to be skating, that like you go into right. a room, you could dance and shit. But there's speakers everywhere. So like the DJ, even though the DJ booths over there, it's like the whole area. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, like, when we was young, we used to like be in that little DJ room doing nasty shit. <laughs> like, <laughs> you like know, dipped off behind the, you know what I mean? So I, I see what you mean with the whole different skate rings. I've been the ones in Milwaukee, the ones in Alabama and in Georgia, of course, and the you ones know, in uh, Kansas. Rings. That's something different. Huh? Georgia rings are a whole different. Well, well, you got it depends on which one. Like everybody think I'm talking about the Cascade. I have not been to the Cascade. Oh, nigga, all America. Where do I want to go? But um, it's like the ones here. All right, the one in Alabama that we got is like it's just a big oval, same like what Vocab said, but it's one that got the DJ booth in the center, mm-hmm. but it's not on the floor. It's like kind of think like an auditorium with a with a balcony, right? That's what the DJ booth. Well, like, one is like, yeah. I know then, yes. then we got one that kind of remind me of roll bounces. Yeah. Okay. Then we got one that's kind of like Rose Mountainish, but then the one I go to here or one I've been to here is just like a big skate floor. Then they do have the the session stand, like what Vocal said, with seating area, but they also have enough space to have another little section to sit closer to the right. rink. And I thought I think I like that one better. Which one is that? Ah, uh, I would have to ask my home because I went there with him when I first moved. I like I I do not remember. I first moved up here. Like I, he yeah. met me at work and he was like, You want to go skate? I'm like, sure, I got nothing better to do. So I've right. been to Cascade, which is like the big one. That's the one that like you see in the movies and shit. ATL, yeah. But my fucking skating ring is all American, which is like 
It's like Stone Mountain-ish area, but it's not really Stone Mountain. It's like on that divide going from like Snellville to Stone Mountain. Mm-hmm. That shit. Oh, that's the one I went to. Oh, that's the one? Yeah, I know exactly what you're talking about. That one busts, bro. When I talk about like, if you want like the hype of Cascade, but without the bullshit that comes with being like famous. Bro, got the ghetto. Yeah, exactly. Basically, <laughs> basically. <laughs> if you don't want the, if you want the hype of Cascade, but without the bullshit. Like, that's the so it's called All American and it's, it's fire, bro. At least the last time I went, it was still fire. I haven't been there like a couple years, though. The last time I went to All American was right before COVID hit. So like 2019, mid like 2019. Okay. I'll be done drawing my hair like 10 more minutes. Oh no, you good, you good. We actually go away and get back into it now. We didn't wait out. We didn't had our 10 minute break. We're gonna go ahead and get back in this thing. So we can get 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 pushing because we all got work tomorrow. So yeah, let's go <laughs> the okay, there. But we got work to do tomorrow, you know. So mm-hmm. yeah, this yeah, we don't get paid for this, so <laughs> I'm right, quit my right. Drive, not, yet. not yet. It's right. coming. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's coming. Change is gonna come. Mm-hmm. All right, so uh Rod, I was just we started this off. We were just talking about uh Shibuya Arc for Jujutsu Kaisen for oh. next year, two cores. They're doing a Shibuya arc for that one, which is where they were trying to go last time. So it's gonna be that's gonna be interesting. interesting. Oh, okay. Well, good for them. I, I, I gotta get into Jujutsu Kaisen. I'm probably since I finished part one of One Piece, I'm probably gonna jump into that. I will say when you start that, you're not going to stop that. That's I'm gonna let you know that easy. now. Like JJK is, is one of those, bro. So give yourself like a day because like it hit from day one yeah like from the first episode one of those bro okay yeah like i watched i watched one episode when i was at work and i was like okay this is kind of interesting they're like 10 15 minutes like okay this looks interesting but i I was just swamped with work calls i couldn't focus like one piece i can watch yeah definitely yeah one piece i can watch especially since I'm gonna just say this quick critique when we get back to the game. What is up with One Piece using 130 to 22 minute time slot just for recapping the opening? <laughs> I told Look, you that. Happens. Don't let I Manny, don't know. let Manny oh, hear you that. say that, bro. I hate that. It is true though. It's true though. Like they'll I'm have like a good six, seven minutes to, to 15 of, of recap at the beginning. Don't it's do that, Manny. Don't do that. It's not 15. You're talking about some C. Don't do that, Monty. I told y'all don't do that, bro. I said I mean, a third. I said a third of twenty-two minutes. That's not even ten minutes. That's yeah, like no, no. Minutes. It, it, it's a bit. It's a bit of a, a stretch it's on like there. Five. It's like five, bro. Yeah, about a third. I'm saying a third just to be. I'm probably overestimating yeah. at a third. I timed it. It's like five minutes. Out of twenty-two, yeah, yeah that's about a third. That is about a third technically. Twenty-two minute episode, five minutes. That's a bit about a quarter. Four minutes. That's a quarter. Not to mention the intro. No, I'm counting the intro. intro. I'm counting the intro. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Oh. It's One stopped piece. in like six. I think I know why Netflix out One Piece now. It actually makes sense to me now. Because with Netflix, you can skip the intro and you can skip the recap. I noticed this with Pokemon. So yep. I've got to. So you want yep. to go skip, skip? <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. Yep. Oda was ahead the intro, of the game. It's the, it's the intro and the recap. And skip the outro. Like, I'll be honest, if they did that with Bleach, it'd have been better. Hey, Panda, put me on what? the put me on the screen. Oh, I got you. Give me a second. Uh-oh, don't do it. Don't do it. Okay, bro. Don't do it, girl. We making the last drink of the night. Oh, I thought he was gonna say something. And I'll be trying to tell people, bro, don't sleep on the Gatorade and liquor, bro. You gotta have the right Gatorade though. Not- it used to be the same with vitamin water back in the day. I used to with Cardi and um, coconut vitamin Monty, water. You doing, you doing the most, Monty. You doing the most. It ain't fifteen minutes long. It is not fifteen it's minutes. Not, long. bro. 
Like, where is Greg when you need him? Don't get me wrong. I will give right. you the fact I, I, I mess with the that we board, missed like five to six minutes because of the recap like, after a certain point in the in the center. series. But it's still okay. is better do. and longer. Okay. I'm not even gonna say better. It's still a longer running no, series. This is than game. Anything else out there, outside of the goats, outside it of the goats. The goat. And we talking about we talking about like the old schools that then came out, right? So, mm-hmm. you know, we talking about like, eh, like. The old old school. Yeah, like you know the more I, I, yeah, the more I get one piece, I get why one piece is pop. It's 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 one of those like it's the old saying. Sometimes you're just along for the ride. You get to a certain point where it's just you're you're you've been riding. You know what? I'm just gonna ride this to the wheels. But I get it. Trust yeah. me, I, I mean, get it's it. It's not a it's not a Saze sign. It's not it's not Rontaro. You know what I mean? It's not those. It's not the Oku Club. Like the old schools, the Doramons and stuff like that. It still ain't there yet. Like it's not the longest running anime. That's what people fail to realize. It's nah. not. Yeah, Pokemon got to beat by far. <laughs> like by a little bit, by a very not little by bit. far. It's only ahead by like a hundred, hundred fifty, two hundred episodes. And it's still going, episode. is it not? It, they yeah. both are, but honestly, both anime say, started, I think, in ninety nine. One Piece and Pokemon yeah. both started in ninety nine. Both started in ninety nine. I will say this though: I don't believe in. I don't believe in Pokemon being the longest running. I I understand why people say it because as yeah, the Pokemon franchise it is, but they didn't have That's fifteen years. Right. right. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. I mean, is it really yeah, the longest running franchise? Yeah, Sanse San has been forever. Like yeah, that's been going on to what like the fifties or sixties. I'll just, I'll just right. about ask, what about Case Close? How many episodes Case Close got? Case Close is out there too. Case Close yeah, about the same amount as One Piece in our. Like I think it's another. Though. Yeah, I think it's another one that came out in eighty nine too. Like not, in, it's like Case no, Close, Case Close, Close they're like eleven now. something now. It will be beat. Like it's beat now because it was only like a thousand. It was like a thousand. A thousand and one or something. Like, it had to hit a thousand because the One Piece that. Well, when did when did Case Close stop? My bad. No, Case Close is still ongoing. I'm trying to see what year it started. Okay, okay. Let me see what year it started. I want to say '99 they, too. Close. They're definitely close. They started in '96. Oh, right. Wow. Okay. Yeah. So they're both close at this point. One piece thing might is, catch up, is, but it depends. Right. I wish Case Close was a little more mainstream, though. Don't we all? It should have been. I mean. When the when a donkey movie at CSI was like a hottest show, I don't get how they didn't cross promote that properly. I, I to this day I'll never understand that. Pretty much, Case Clothes was just anime CSI, but they didn't market it that way. Basically, so most people would have probably got sick of Conan shit probably like season seven. Just to be honest, I, people were like, wait, this kid he's still a kid. Revamp Rama one half. Wow, big shit. Make Boji great again. Not make Budgie great again. I'm done. Anyway, all right. Let's get back. To God bless. Good night. <laughs> <laughs> right. All right. Let's get back to this game. All right. This thing so, case close only has 988 episodes, but that's not true. I know they hit a thousand. But think about when they made it, though. When, when did they make that? Whatever post you're looking at. What's the date on that? I'm looking. I'm trying to find it. Yeah. Shit, I don't right. think. I know they hit a thousand, bro. Shit, I don't even think Simpsons had a thousand yet. Yeah, they did. Yeah, they had a thousand. Simpsons had a thousand? Yeah, they had a whole thing about it. Yeah, they've been yeah. here a thousand. Damn, I didn't think oh, they had a thousand like Four or five years ago? Yeah, it's see. been a minute. Damn, Simpsons had a... Damn, I, I, would have, I thought I would remember something like that. Damn. I don't see how you did it. No, oh yeah, it came out 89. Longest running, how many episodes? Nothing, you no, Simpsons only have seven hundred twenty nine. I thought so. As a what, day. what day was that written? Let me see. I'm looking. At, I'm checking the Wikipedia article, but let me see episode count. Right, this is what day was it written though? Wait, hold on. Let me figure this out. Episode count. At ten. Oh, one thousand fifteen. For what? 
for case closed. Yeah. That's what I was like. Yeah. I'm, I'm, no, I'm 728 no episodes as of May 2nd, 2022. So, so, it, I, it I had remember been. the Simpsons having a thousand episode special. I could have sworn that was probably that. a joke. Yo, that was probably yo, a joke. Uh, no, it, it could not have been a joke unless we hit on Mandela say I remember that. Now, go around. The Simpsons only do 22 episodes a season, so no way it hit a thousand by now. What? How long the Simpsons been on? The Simpsons been on since '89. They still you don't think they hit a thousand by now? Probably not. No, 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 no. You're that's yeah. right. It won't occur until 2033. I could have swore it happened. Me too. Maybe they did it as a gag. Maybe it was a joke episode or something. Yeah, I think we got a yeah. that shit, but I remember that. Yeah. I remember that vividly. No. No, it's not there yet. Nope. I thought I I, I was gonna say I know the Simpsons didn't hit a thousand. I was like, I know for I, I would have put money on that. I've been walking away with some money right about now, be honest. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, run me my money. Be like Ronnie and the Punch. Run me, run me my, my money. Run me run my money. Me. Run me my money. All right, all right. Let's get back to this. Let's get back to this. So, yeah, let's anyway, so let's get back to Killer Volcano. You're staring at this creature. I'm not dying, bro. What <laughs> people die every day. You want to do or say <laughs> or? Die. Oh, actually, give me. You gave me. What was your perception check on that when you first looked at him? Oh, I'm going back. My first one, the first, I did a 25 and then I did a 14. 25 was for the room, and that's what made you see him, because he was kind of blended into the, he was the same color as the Iron Maiden, which is why you didn't see him the first time. Um, I would say him, I thought it was a check. When he came out, it was 14, so yeah, you're not, yeah, you didn't notice that, sorry. Okay, so what are you going to do? Hmm. Well, we got to, well, he's, we can't leave him, man, that's kind of messed up. I, I thought I was gonna levitate him over, but it's too heavy. Yeah. Well, I mean, let me, uh, Panda, let me ask him does he know who he's created by? Go ahead. All right. Do you know who created you? Create. You brought me close for that? To make, to construct. Yeah. To make known to the world. I. Yes. No. 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 Memory banks. Corrupted. Unable to process requests. I should know, but don't. Please. Okay. Do you know I your purpose? Purpose, and he fully now steps out of the uh, of the Iron Maiden, and you thought he was six foot, and he's like seven five. He was oh, actually that. down in that Iron Maiden, <laughs> and as his fingers release from the door. You hear the iron once again, like uncrinkle as it. Un- Have you seen my gray coat? Oh, no, mind. And like his imprint is definitely in the door right now. Like he broke the steel spikes that were at the tip of the Iron Maiden when he grabbed it. He didn't flinch, nothing. Purpose. Purpose. Door. And he stops and he points at the well. Door, 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 open, close, home. No, yes, go, door, door, door. And he just says door over and over and over for like the next five minutes. And then he falls silent. And his fingers just pointing at the at the uh, well. Jen, yeah. At this, not Jen, not Jen. Jay, 
At this point, you went to the cl- cabinet to grab the uh the glove. Is that right? Chest, chest, but okay. No, it was actually a cabinet, actually. You said chest last time. You definitely okay. said chest. Fine, I'll say chest then because y'all thank you. He got it out of the chest. Okay, Toriyama. So chest, <laughs> chest. You see the chest. Um, you went for the gloves though, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, you have the greens on you, and you're just gonna what are you gonna do? You're gonna try to scoop up the the other two? Yes. Just tuck them, or what are you doing? I'm gonna chuck them. Okay. What do you what where are you putting them? Mm. Inside my cloak. Inside your cloak. So you reach for you have green. You reach for the red. No issue. You grab them, put them up. You reach for the blue. It repels you. Shut up. Damn. Actually, give me a perception check. <laughs> Not a bad idea. Why are you trying to have to read here the blood? Perception is great. 14. Oh, that's enough. As you reach for the blue, you notice that the being that y'all are talking to the construct. Oh, that's a 10. Not a 14. Yeah, you you barely see this, bruh. You literally almost catch a fist to the face. As you see the automaton with reflexes like a freaking with reflexes like Wolverine. <laughs> okay. Is that because he picked up the blue gloves? He reaches past you and puts his hand on top of the blue gloves on top of yours. Who, who did this? The automaton. Is that the, the stone statue? Yeah, guy? The stone thing. Yeah. Oh, okay. And he's like, no, no, must, must have, no, must have, must, please, sorry, no, please, oh, sorry, man. no, no, yes, fast, must have. And he lets him go. Right. And like sits back like, in, like he's apologetic for what he just did. Right. Mm. But his he he like the words were still. You felt the sincerity of the words. You just be picking up everybody else's gloves. Can I ask my gloves? Who they? What they, if they know anything about these gloves? Uh yeah, Leandra is which is. Leandra, yeah. Oh, Leandra, you um, you ask her, um, and she's like, mm. "Wait, wait, blue, 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 gloves." Wait a minute. Who, who, who was it? 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 Mm. See why? Why can't get that animation? Why? Why can't get a better animation? No, yeah. no, honey. I don't. I don't. I don't know anything about. I do, but I don't. I do, but I. I don't. My memory still. You know, I told you about this. My memory's a bit hazy on some of that stuff from when I died and everything. And right. you know how they betrayed me, and they, they was talking all that stuff. And like, I remember we were working on the gloves, but that's all I remember. Like I, there was a blue set though. There was a blue set. What about the other colors? You don't hear this. This is in his head. Uh-huh. Yeah, this is him talking to the black gloves. 
I'm gonna need you to talk to most of the black gloves. <laughs> you don't know this. <laughs> so the question is, what do you do? Because he just reached back and he let go of the gloves. And when he gripped your hand, you realize he could have easily broken every bone in your hand at that point. Damn, man, but he, he, I'm tired he of you making me sound weak, bro. And guess you ain't got nothing to do with that, bro. My head and everything. <laughs> you're a changeling, my guy. No offense, you're probably the the most breakable of everybody. You're quite fragile, my guy. Broke out. Not Shut fragile. Up. It's just your 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 body moves in different ways. It's able to be manipulated. I don't like how that sound. <laughs> it just sounds kind of. It was your choice. <laughs> we manipulating bodies out here, cuz. Okay, I leave the gloves there. Huh? You had? Did you hand it to him? I left him alone. I ain't touch him. I ain't finna get oh, my yeah. arm broke. Okay, yeah. okay. So you just get him moving. He he looks at you. Like you've never seen, you've seen like beings of stone before, right? Mm -hmm. You're a bounty hunter, it's what you do. You've seen beings of stone before. You never thought you could see. All right, Monty, have a good one. Night, Monty. All right, good night. <laughs> you never thought you could see night, night. a stone feel sad. Does that make sense? Yeah. Like you see a remorsefulness in his eyes. I've seen sad stone for what he did, and he 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 just reaches back down real gingerly and says, and slowly, like he made sure there's no speed to his movements or nothing, and he just slowly reaches down and grabs him and says, "Thank you," and he pulls him up to himself. Um, I will say at this point, Jen, because you are the most perceptive of everybody. You do notice his hands look like Diesel's did before he put gloves on. Mm -hmm. He doesn't put the gloves on right now, but you notice his hands look like Diesel's did before he put those black gloves on. The stripped way, the rawness of it, all of that. Even in the rock, it just like looks like it's etched and ingrained into his hands. Body's down there. Right. Um, he just holding the gloves says, "Um, home." Damn, Rex, get out my way, bro. Home and points towards the the uh the the well. No way. Hmm. And then he takes a step towards it. Let's go with him. I will. You see, before he goes in, though, you see him put the gloves on on both sides, and the hands. That's tough. The gloves just disappear. They basically That's fuse tough. into his own construct hands. Hmm. So you can't even see he has gloves on. No just, way. He doesn't look like. It. And he, he looks at Diesel and he sees the gloves. And he looks at the two gloves that are on uh, Jay's side. And he looks at Rod. He looks at uh, Jen and says, he said kind of cocks to the side and it's like, you. Why the bus for you? Vocabs. You strong? Hmm. You break barrier? That's up. That's no gloves? There we go. Hmm. Hmm. And you I'm see him reach cool. for the gloves on his hand. And he starts to pull them. Like he reached for a cuff that's not there. Remember, I told you it blended into his hand, right? He reaches for a cuff of a glove because you all know it's there. And he starts to pull. 
and you hear the grinding of stone and steel as he reaches, as he pulls them off of his hands. And you start to see this liquid, this ichor of like blue and green start to like leak from his hands. That's tough. It's jaw just like shakes to the side, just like grimacing as he's pulling. He looks like he's in pain. Was that just pulling them from his right hand? He just continues to pull and pull as he's talking to you. What do you do? Mm, um, yeah. Do you do anything? Mm, that's a tough one. Hmm. I said, let him. He hasn't hurt us. We know I did see the things with his hands. I said, let this ride out. See what happens next. He literally. So he put them on, and so and he's just about to take them off again. He's about to take them off. Now, give me a... Actually, Diesel, give me a... No, you would know this just in general. There's no reason to roll. You know that if any time Leandra is removed from you, the way that he's doing right now, you know that's why your hands look the way they did. Because they were forcibly removed from you. That would have been your blood. That would have been your skin. That would have been your bone. I'm glad that you're telling me this. I ain't putting them bitches on, right? <laughs> I already got two pairs on. You see what I'm saying? You know. Yeah. And so. You see him doing this. The only reason for someone to go through that much pain would be for certain reasons. Okay. Let me ask the automaton, why why are you taking those gloves off? Who's done, bro? He needs not die. No, no more. Death. No more. Death. And he just keeps pulling. And like, you would think he was crying. As he continues to pull the glove off of, and it's not even off of one hand yet. He's still pulling and pulling to try to rip this glove from his hand. What about the gloves will cause death? You know this already, actually. I do? You okay. Know. You do. Yeah, because you have Leandro. Conversation. Leandro, how do you pronounce our name? Huh. Yeah, you've mm -hmm. already had your conversations. You know <laughs> that <laughs> at least with Leandro. Okay. Okay. Yeah, you only know from your. You know, from magic, you know there are other items, magical items like this, that mm -hmm. have living souls attuned and bound to them, that they are become symbiotic with whoever wears them and agrees to the contract of the item. And as such, if they are removed forcibly, and not through magical means, it can literally destroy oh, the person's bad. hand. That is trying to remove them. Which means most people only do it that route anyway for a very personal reason. Or a very, you know what I mean? Important yeah. thing. Yeah. Okay. I don't like the way I used to all right, let me ask him. 
What? All right. Why did you put the gloves on in the first place? Gloves. Part of program. Gloves. Part of me. Igor speak. Igor know more. He and he stops for a second, pulling. And like you can see the glove very loosely hanging. Like the part that's been ripped off, very loosely hanging now, because it's been actually removed from his skin at this point. The rest of it is still it's like think of like a bunched up glove being pulled off, and the rest of it just looks like his regular skin. You know mm. what I mean? Like his fingers still look like his regular fingers. He stops and he points to Jay. And said so he hold other gloves. Right. And he, and he has no gloves. No more death. But must go home. Oh. And he grabs that glove again on his hand and starts to continue to pull. And you see the grimacing, you hear the screeching and the screeling and the the, the liquid continues to like squirt and like Think of like a, a car with a with a leaky like the squirts fluid antifreeze and stuff like that's what you're seeing. This just like this black and blue, this blue and green ichor just squirting randomly as from his hands as he continues to pull this off. I'm like literally torn if I want to put these gloves on or not right now. You gotta put them on, or you're gonna die. You I can't hear you because you're not here. Do you let him finish pulling them off? Well, we know that. We've been here for a long time. I will. You will. Okay. Yeah. Right. Well, we can. He can put the gloves on. Huh? I said he can put the gloves on. That's fine. He wants to use the gloves. No, nah, you talking about the, the are, are we gonna let him continue so taking them off? Them oh, off. taking them off. I'm, my back. He thinking yeah. Yeah. he can take them off. Sound like he's suffering with the gloves. Something's something's going on that he. I think he want to give you the gloves because he saw you didn't have any. Yeah. But this nigga Jay got two pairs of gloves. Selfish ass. No you do too. Shut up. Okay. You're yeah. Not but, <laughs> ain't no. I came by myself, nigga. You gonna let this nigga ride die? Ryan had a choice. He did not want to do, touch no gloves, remember? That's facts. I guess Ryan won't die. I hope he's offering me the gloves. There must be a reason he's offering me the gloves. Yeah, because you don't have any on you. He right, literally I'll... just said he has gloves. He has none. And All right, I'll take... to pull it off. All right, well, I'll take the gloves if he's asking, if he's going to give them to me. He probably knows more about the gloves than I do. Right. Tell this nigga Jay to give you a pair of his gloves. He got two. No. He said no because both have not there. Said no. I ain't there. <laughs> this nigga Jay said no, nigga. <laughs> Damn, bro, you gonna die. What? Hmm. Oh. Hmm. Well, I should probably get some gloves. Oh, if he's giving me his gloves, I should be fine. But then that's not fair. He wouldn't have any gloves. Exactly. At this point, he's pulled one of the gloves off his hands. And when I say that hand drops limp like Batman beat him in the back alley. Hmm. Damn. That, that makes would be, sense. Yeah. Well, we don't know. That's how that arm dropped. And he uh, tosses the glove to you. And then he brings the hand, the limp hand, right? He brings the good hand down to the limp hand and forces himself to barely lift the limp hand up and grip the other one and start trying to pry the other one mm. from his 
hand. Why are y'all letting this happen? I don't know. I'm thinking because he wants this. She has two girls. Oh, okay, if he's giving me his gloves, then there's only one thing to do. If he's gonna offer me my gloves, we gotta repay him back. So, well, I think Jay got two things. All right. Well, can I, I'll chime in. I'll say, um, guys, if he finishes taking off that second glove. He'll probably die. Oh, oh, we don't want that. I won't want nobody's death on my hands. So, sounds like all right then. I give him his little to put back on, and I guess I would ask Jay for the other set of gloves at this point. Something so if he needs the gloves to live, I would. I won't want nobody to die that needs something to give it to me out of the kindness of their heart. I couldn't live with that, honestly. He let me get the gloves. Hey, yeah, he didn't care about the other ones. He only stopped you from grabbing the blue ones. Exactly. One so why do I got to give him my gloves? You got two. You pairs. got two pairs. So if he's gonna die. It, okay, now knowing that information, maybe I should get a pair of gloves. If there are some left, maybe I can. Use There's none left. Pair. I have the yellow and the purple. That nigga oh, Luxa Don Diesel got the black. This nigga up <laughs> got the blue and Jay got right, so Jay the, got green. the green ones and the red ones. He picked up the red ones when y'all walked back in the room. Vocab took the purple and the yellow day one and jumped. Yeah, I did. I'm out of here. <laughs> I'm out of here, bro. Actually, you're only wearing the purple right now. You're not wearing both. No, I put one of each. I put the yellow on my left hand and I put the purple on my right hand. Uh, you got told. You got. You got. You got stopped to change. And then remember the the I got the voice that was like, oh, who chooses that? Blah blah blah. blah that blah. was the purple one. That's why he made you put the old both purple on. No, yeah, I, I had I jumped with both of them shoes on. I never changed it. Okay, I'll look. I'm gonna go back and re-listen to that because I'm pretty go sure. Go ahead, bro. I'm I have go one of each on both ends. I have one of each on. The the All yellow right. was on my left and the purple was on my right. Mm -hmm. Bro, when I say this, exactly. Anyway, Jen, let's crack it. No. I know what? I thought you asked me to get some out of my gloves. No, I said Jen. Oh, doing? I thought you said Jay. Oh no, I'm I gonna I'm gonna let him put his gloves back on. He's I'll, still gonna pull them off. He's still pulling these off because you don't have gloves on. You have no gloves on your hand, and he's talking about going down that well. He's saying he's until you have some, he's gonna keep going. Shit. Hmm. Idea. Who's trying to kill somebody now, Jay? Well, I mean, he been trying to kill me. He been telling you to kill me off the whole. In my head, you're dead already. See exactly, but I'm not though. I'm what color do you want, right? What's the colors? Green and blue. Red and green. I mean, yeah, red and green. My bad. Red and red. red, red. red. On my tongue, right? It will. I'm gonna go. Hmm. All right, I'll go with red oh, against my better judgment. I'm gonna choose red. I got a funny feeling about red, but because you just said green, I would have said fuck no. You had the red ones. Get the right buttons. Why did you? I was gonna say that nigga definitely was the name. Why you even do that? <laughs> I was gonna see if he know me because he would have said green. I'm like fuck no. <laughs> I was gonna say there's no way you see in the green gloves, bro. <laughs> 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 I knew that. I was like, there's no way this nigga gave me the green gloves. None. <laughs> this shit is not happening. Okay, so you throw him the red gloves? Yeah. I'll take the red gloves. Are you throwing them to him, Jay? I hand them to him. I ain't gonna throw them to him because he might All not right, touch right. them. 
Yeah, we're you not. We're not. Him. We're not about to be Gohan out here. <laughs> <laughs> like Jay, Jay, Jay Kase about these about that life. It seems like he's sitting he here like he's a hardened bounty hunter for real, for real. No, nah, he bought that. Okay, okay. So he hands you the gloves, and in in as you get the gloves in your hand, you see his grip release and a smile like start to curl, like slowly, like. It's a painful little grin on his face. And he goes and reaches back for the other glove and slides it slowly back over the bloody, ickered, metal-scarred surface and stone scorcher of his hand. And he slowly puts it back over. And he just kind of sits there and says home and like walks over he can't really put his hand on the edge so he like puts like his forearm on it and kicks his leg over like you can see he looks like he's in freaking pain like if anybody if any normal human would have undergone that they would have passed out and he kicks his legs over and says Clean, safe, and jump. Clean, safe. The queen is safe, yay. And as y'all look, are y'all looking down the well? Yeah, I'm looking. Yeah. They have dark vision. Who has dark vision? I think I do. But I'm, I'm asking, does anybody have dark vision? No, I don't um, think I have anything like that. Right now, don't count. I don't count, so. No, I don't. Nobody has dark vision? Okay. So with that being the case, y'all don't see anything but a poof of smoke, like of like red, just like sizzling. That's it. Not smoke, but like red sizzling. That's all you see. What are y'all doing? What y'all doing? Oh, we've come this far. We might as well just jump in this portal and get it over with. Just do it, bro. Just do it. As much as I've been against this idea of jumping in this damn portal, jump let's in go. The portal, bro. Come on. Let's go. It's either no, we jump in this portal or we have to deal with the guards. At this point, let's just go. All right. I say you guys... Judging by what the automaton did, you may want to put on those gloves before you jump in. That's facts. Put the gloves on, bro. Okay. Equip the gloves. Equip the gloves. Jay, you putting your green ones on? Yeah. Okay. And they're just they're just red and green gloves. They've got like there's like regular gloves with like a red a couple red gems across it. Uh, the green one is like um, a saw uh, like a deep green forest green, right? But it's got like no no it's a forest green, but it's got like a green like <laughs> on the other side of it. So it's like it's an emerald green inlay on the inside. Okay, I'll roll with that. So, I mean, you can flip them inside out if you want. They do look reversible. This, this is okay. I might they might have some power and they backfire because they inside out. Okay. I mean, it's up to you. <laughs> I'm good. Okay. Okay. So is everybody jumping? Let's go. Yep. Who's going first? What's the order? I'll probably go last. I'm gonna probably be the one that's most hesitant and just annoyed with going through this portal in the first place. Yeah, I'll go first. I'll yeah, I'll go first. 
Who's next? All right. I'll go after. You go after that, and then I'll go last. I'll be last. last. Reluctantly going last because I don't like this idea anyway. But I think you do not want to jump in that bit. Okay. I haven't jumped. I haven't, I haven't not trusted this portal since jump. So as each of you go down, you you feel a sizzle in your soul. <laughs> you, feel, you feel a little sizzle, like your body basically disapparates, almost as if burning, and you disappear. There is pain. There is a distinct pain. Did you look at? Not like you're burning a lot. I didn't have no pain, nigga. <laughs> How do we know? Because are... I remember exactly what happened when I jumped. Not like you're burning a lot, but like you're you're experiencing a cleansing, like a heat cleansing. Does that make sense? Kind of like a phoenix, like a laser, like a laser. A laser is going over your body, and just like cleaning everything off of it, but it's heated. Not deathly, not not extremely painful, but just enough to to cause. Laser tattoo removal. Tattoo removal. There you go. Laser tattoo removal. There you go. Like that. Um. All right. We done. We did enough with everybody else. Let's go to Silk. Hey, I finally arrived. Huh? So you were. Good night. <laughs> <laughs> So you were in room, yeah, whole shit, right? Yeah, you were in room. You were here, right? That's and where I'm you at. Hearing clicking, you heard clicking. Every mm-hmm. so many seconds, you heard another set of clicking. And yep. Click. And you had you had discerned that it was the doors at that point in time. Yes, I did. You had discerned it was the doors. Um, you had also read the little mantle piece. I did, and you know, what I'm saying discerned what that was based on your. I think you had like an all seeing, like a knowledge eye or something like that. I think with a spell or ability to cast something like that. Oh my God, hold on, I'll tell you what it's called. I remember you could read stuff. Oh, wait, let me get what it is. Uh, comprehend languages. There we go. Yeah, that shit. So. You had comprehended the language. You had read the piece on there, and you knew it was kind of like, okay, well, how the heck do I get out this mother? That's where you at right now. Like, how do I? How do I get out of here? Because none of this seems to. Um. You do. Actually, you know what? Give me. An investigation check because you're checking the room right now, you're trying to see what's going on. Investigation, there. investigation, give me an investigation. Um, 26. 26. Yeah, yeah, you definitely saw a real nigga uh, roll. So, you notice in the corner down here, you notice this again, essential, similar. <laughs> To the one that was around the well. Again, it's a teleportation decision. All right. Everything else in the room can't seem to. You hear the clicking of the doors, but when you hear them, you don't really catch the doors opening or flickering or anything like that. You know what I mean? You don't see any change in them, even though you're hearing the clicking. So you're like, I don't know if that's the doors or the walls or something in another room. You know, you don't quite know. So you walk back over. To the sigil. Nothing happens when you stand on it, though. Okay. Like last time, you jumped in the in the well. You know what I mean, and it just right. happened. This time, no, there's nothing, nothing happening. Um, where am I? Where you're standing right here on the sigil, right in the okay. center, yeah, right right there. So you stand in the center of it, like you know, thinking something's gonna happen. Right. Um. Give me an arcana check. Uh, 
That's a three. I don't got no mag, no arcana. Shit. Yeah, shit. you don't know nothing. Nah, yeah, I don't have arcana. Yeah. Don't know nothing. Um, that's not gonna help you out because you definitely are not gonna leave this room like that. Uh, <laughs> um, from what? Okay, so with the twenty six from the investigation earlier, though, you realize the only ways out this room are this door here, that door there. Which that one? There. Uh-huh. One. Uh huh. Two. Uh-huh. Three. That's all. Or that teleportation circle. Okay. Mm-hmm. Those are the only the only ways you see out, other than of course how you came in. But right. pretty sure you're not trying to go back now nah. where you came in. Fuck that shit. Right? You not to mention to you probably don't know how at this point, right? Because you just I don't, don't but even if I did, I don't want to go back. I'm trying right. to you know explore, nigga. Let's go. So For the 26, you realize that there is a timing to the lock. Um, you, realize, you realize it's a locking mechanism that's clicking, right? Okay. First time you hear it, you hear it over here, right? And you're standing here at this point in time, but you hear it here. You hear the click, right? But before you can walk over, because you hear it, and you're like, well, let me go see what it's about. Because you, you, you knew. Right, you're new to the area. You don't know what's in this room. You don't want to barge in. You don't want to barge in on nothing, right? You like you try not to die. You're by yourself right now, right? So you walk over, but by the time you do, the clicks tick again, and you feel as you push the door catch, like the lock locked back on you. Mm, okay. You see what I mean? Yeah. And so you wait, and you hear another click. Click. It's not at that door no more, though. No, it's on the next door. No, it clicks behind that door, it seems like. Oh, okay. But you also hear an echoing set of clicks up here, up here. On the other side. Here. Like you hear you hear sets of clicks going at the same time. You know what I'm saying? It's because I'm I mean roll to 26. So you you did good. (laughs) Right, right, right. However, up here. You do eventually catch to where you can time it for this door and this door. Okay. But as you catch it, the one you catch as it clicks through ends up being this door here. Ah. And you pop that door open just in time within that 10 second window. Pop that shit. Open it up. So you, as walking into this room here, you see, of course, another dial. Another, another clock, nigga. Yeah. On the floor. We out here. You also see these two things in the corner. What are those? I need an what are those? I'll give you investigation or arcana for this one. It's a new nigga, rule. I, I'm a good investigator, nigga. I suck at arcana. So we do an investigation. Okay. okay. What we got? 14. 14. Okay. 14. Okay. So you know that they are sigils of sorts. Okay. All right, Jay. We'll All catch right. up with you. Don't worry. I got you covered. We got no other sigils. You know, this one is a displaced sigil. It's been broken up intentionally, right? It was like it was on a stab. I was on a slab, but it's been broken. Okay, so mm-hmm. somebody was trying to stop whatever was going to transpire from occurring at that slab. That's pretty much yeah. what you ascertained. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um, the one is broken. The one is broken. Right, right, right. Yeah. All right. Love y'all. Give me two seconds. I use the bathroom real quick. I don't know why. But oh, right shit. Right. Let me take a piss, too. <laughs> All right, if y'all got to go run, we're going to do a five-minute <laughs> break, and we'll come back, and we'll finish this off probably in the next 30, 45 minutes. Okay? Okay. okay. All right. All right. Quick five.
All right, cool. I'm sorry about that. I don't know how they be doing that. Like the DMs would be like, yo, we gotta go for four, five hours or something. I gotta go pee. I need a minute. You know what I mean? Like that. <laughs> I didn't have water and stuff. Like got to be getting up. Anyway. All right. We'll wait for everybody to get back. And then we'll finish this part out. You all will land. Or die, who knows? We'll see. Uh D, did you get the um the other link group link I sent y'all? Uh, I'm not, not sure how to me. Uh I sent a group link for all of y'all in Facebook. Uh for y'all to have if y'all need side conversations and stuff. Oh, uh, gotcha. No, I haven't even looked at it yet, to be honest. That's fine. That's fine. I just put it out there. Y'all can remove me whenever y'all want to. So that way I don't hear. But that way, if y'all want to make plans against me, y'all can. Cool, cool. Cool. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, I, didn't, I wasn't paying attention. Oh, no, you good. You good. Yeah, I oh, made that second right. so y'all can, kick, y'all can boot me from that one so that way when y'all need to make plans, because y'all will eventually need to make plans <laughs> that I don't know about, y'all can do it in there. So. Cool, cool. Yeah, we'll do that. I'm not gonna lie, I forget where I found that beat, but I like it for the intro. Oh, good. I was like, what beat? And you said for the intro. The number of notes I have for this. Oh wow, I ain't heard that in a minute. Hey yo, that stream we did earlier. Well done. Say what? The DJ stream. Well done. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You should you should like schedule them. Yeah, I, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna start doing it. Yeah. Like Cause I know a couple people like I've I got a couple people that I watch that are DJs. That are on, it's on Twitch. Mm-hmm. They can they make some bank when they do it because like just because yeah. you got cosplay stuff like that so you can make some money just DJing on there so yeah most definitely I mean, we could promote it on here too oh uh, yeah oh yeah definitely oh speaking of which I forgot to make the announcement earlier when we have more people in here uh huh what's up today is the last day. To submit your favorite anime opens or closings for me uh, to do the mix. It has been two weeks. It has. It has. So go yeah, put yeah, go in the Discord. Intro. And go intro. put your openings or closings. It could be closings too. Mm-hmm. Your favorite anime openings or closings, and I'm gonna make the DJ mix. And it'll be done by next Sunday. Cool. Jungle Butter. Ow. We waiting on Jen. Yeah, yeah, waiting on Jen. Well, actually, we can keep going while Jen's gone because right now it's just you. 
just me. So let's go ahead and do that. So uh you you look at let me switch screens here. Okay. So you looked at the, the broken piece here, mm-hmm. right? And you don't know what it was. You don't know, you know what you what it could have been or anything like that. Um yeah, you don't have identify either, so you couldn't you couldn't try that. Um you're you're not sure. You just know it's a magic lift that is it seems similar to the other one, right? Mm-hmm. But you don't know what it was for. You just know somebody it looks like it was intentionally broken though. Right? Yeah. Like somebody like a hammer to it or something like that and like shattered it. Um constantly you hear the clicking. Click, 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 click. Right? Every 10 seconds or so. Um, and you've timed them now. So you hear them going off and going off and going off. And right. you realize though, in this room, there's no other doors but the one you came into. It is the one. Just the one. Right. And the little However, things on you the floor. know that you came in on a clock initially right. and there's a clock in this room too there is which means which means i can use it to teleport Maybe or something can come in or something can come in and kill from me. that point right. right because jay wants me to die so bad i'm not gonna die okay <laughs> If I was gonna make you die, I'd at least let him be here to watch it. I would at exactly. least give him satisfaction. So right. you're safe for tonight. <laughs> I am. Damn right I am. Um, but okay, as the clicking and stuff is going, yeah, I'm planning this shit, bro. You suddenly hear a like a billowing of wind, like a rush of energy. Mm. And it's not in the room you're in. Right. Sounds like it's from where you just were. You say is in the one I just was? Sounds like it. Okay. Remember, because you're listening, you've been listening to like clicks echo off walls. Like right. you know what I'm saying? You don't think anybody else is in here right now. You haven't heard any footsteps, nothing. You, exactly. you've been hearing just clicking, and now all of a sudden you hear this just big whirlwind of energy, like this tumultuous energy just mm. hitting. It sounds like it's coming from where you just were. So much energy. Right. So much energy. It sounds uh, like maybe light. three people just so showed up. Possibly one the size of an elephant. I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> so you you show up, you walk you walk into the room and you do see everybody else with this elephant person. Oh, I, I'm able to go back. You walk into the other room. Yeah. Okay. And you see this elephant person and this rock creature. The first thing you see is this rock creature because it appears on its own. I ain't not gonna go and back. That's pretty cool. There. And he turns and looks at you. And he turns and looks at the fireplace and steps off the clock towards the fireplace and just stops and turns around and faces the clock. Okay. And then he turns and looks at you and he's like, Are you the new keeper? I am, bitch. You don't look like a keeper. Bitch, I said I am. Don't question me. He turns to you, like full body turns. His hands. We're on his side. That was Come up. You know the anime pinnacle that they mm-hmm. do with their hands? Like the detectives do? You know what I mean? He does that. <laughs> he does the anime pinnacle with his hands. <laughs> and looks at you. And the fingertips touch his chin as he says, You lie. You lie so easily. Why? Wait, what? I'm sorry. I can't hear you. sound mad low. He says, you lie. You lie so easily. Why? Why did I lie? 
about being the new keeper? Is that is that what he asking? He just stands and stares at you. Oh. Bitch, I ain't lying. It's me, nigga. What you talking about? Who told you I lied? Back to the. He turns back to the disc, the, the to the disc, and puts his hands down, and says, "You are not the keeper." Who told you I'm not the keeper? I will wait. And he just stands there. He said, "I will wait," and he just stands there. You, yeah, he says, "You are not the keeper." He turns back and faces the clock and just waits. Like he's waiting. He just stands there like he's waiting for something. Mm-hmm. He's going to leave him there? Yeah, leave that. Damn. Huh? He said, am I just going to leave him there? Yeah, he's going to leave him there? You can. This the rock nigga, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to leave him there and I'm going to go talk to the elephant nigga. No one's in there. It's just him right now. It's just him that came through. I thought you said I saw all three of them. Oh, uh, not yet. He just came through first. That's what you just said. Man. I did. You did. No, no, he came through first. I did. I forgot he came through first though. He came through first. All right. He came through first. So it's just yeah, this he came through first. No one else is there yet. It's all just right, him. So it's me and this because I was definitely about to try to get this elephant nigga to run this nigga over, bro. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> 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 I'm mean, gonna remember, like they were talking after he jumped in. They were sitting there talking for a minute. So, like, you know what I mean? It's got to right. have some time in between. Right, right, right. All right. So he just standing on the clock. In the, he, the no, first, he's still, he's still the one that I came clock. in the first time. Yeah, the first one. He stepped off the clock. Oh, he to came you. off of it. Yeah, he stepped off of it, and so he talked to you. Now? Show me on just the like thing. One step where off. Like right. Yeah. Let me just, my mouse, my mouse. There we go. Where is that? Okay. So he like literally standing like right, right here. Oh, so he bought a fireplace. Yeah. Like or right whatever there. the hell that shit is. Yeah. And I'm yeah. by the door still. You yeah, you literally just came back to the door to see what happened. I I go back in that second room and close the door back. So you go back up here. Yeah. And close the door. Yeah, fuck that nigga. Okay. So you do that, and as you do, again, the ticking is still going. You hear another energy, right? Mm -hmm. At this point, the rest of you are now on the clock, right? When you all first come in, because you all haven't been here. When you all first come in, it looks like this. You see this big aura under you. Oh, it's right? darker. And then when a few within a few seconds, it vanishes. And all you see is oh, not that one. Wrong room. Definitely not that one. That's the queen room. Where the king tricked us. Fucking. Bullshit Why ass can king. I not find the dragon room? Fuck it that king, right man. This the room we was in where the king fucking tricked us, bro. Yeah, it was. It was. No, no. I'm so I was trying to find the regular room. Yeah. So it's just like the like the blue aura fades from under, yeah. right? Mm-hmm. Um, and now you all are standing in the center of this clock. What would you all like to do? You see the automaton, right? The rock dude standing by right here. No one else is in this room right now, though. It's just y'all. That's just us in the automaton. Yeah, cause I'm in the mm-hmm. in the back little area room. You can't see me yet. Okay. Um, now I will say this, Diesel. You know where you are. Okay. Um. All right. I uh. I tell the group. You guys can follow me. And oh, so you've been there before? Yes, okay. I have. Okay. The uh, so as you come in, 
the automaton, you, does he follow? He looks at you and says, I must wait for the keeper. Bitch, I told that nigga I'm the keeper. In doing so, you understand what he's waiting for. You walk past them, and the engravement that's along this top of this furnace here, you touch. Right? And you turn back and look at him and say, The keeper is not coming. Because I'm already here, bitch. The keeper is with the queen. I'm the keeper with the queen. Nigga, I'm still and in saying that, he turn his head turns and looks at you as if an understanding. Nigga, it's me, nigga. And you just walk. You don't even look back at him. You walk to the portal. Teleportation circle here. Now, Silk, Yo. you hear the you hear whooshing. Uh-huh. Right. However, you closed the door. I did. I closed that shit. I want to see that robot. Now have to refigure out these locks. So I need you to roll an investigation <laughs> check for me. That's fine. Another investigation. Let's get yourself it. out of the room. Let's go. I you lock yourself back in. I. That's fine. I want to see that fuck ass of Tontron nigga. Fuck him. He ain't believe me. Bitch ass nigga. Yeah, well, I mean, nigga, eight. What you get? Yeah, you definitely cannot get out Hell of this no. room right now. You're sitting. I'm, I'm in that. You're bitch. yanking on this door, like hard. I'm in that bitch, bro. I want. I don't even want to go back that way. I'm trying to figure out what the hell that shit is. That little fucking. You're stuck, bro. You are stuck. Yeah. You cannot get out of this room. That's uh, Diesel. Mm-hmm. You step onto. The green area teleportation circle, and you beckon for the uh, the automaton, the rock automaton, and um, Jay and Jen to come with you. Uh, Jen, yep, you know that y'all all came down the same portal that Silk came down, yeah, right? <laughs> So like, you don't cooking? see Silk in here. Don't see me. I'm hiding. What do you want to do before you go to that portal? Or do you go to the portal? What do you want to do? Are you going to try to find me, Jen? Or are you going to just go? I don't care. It's cool. I left hmm. y'all. You can leave me. Hmm. Let's see. I don't see Jay's character, but I don't see... Hmm. I don't know what the hell's going on. I'm like, okay, went through that portal. I reluctantly went through the portal. You did. You did not want to go to that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, where am I? So I can kind of figure this out. I got an idea, but I just want to see where I'm at. So I'm just. You're literally just standing like in the center of this clock. Okay. That's on. I guess I got to look around, see maybe I see anything. Maybe, or maybe the window got me or something. Okay. Okay. Give me a. Uh, I'll give you. I'll give you a choice. No, you don't. Give me an investigation because you're looking around for. Is there anything specific you're looking for? No, I'm just trying to sense to see if I sense maybe maybe a wind picked up something or maybe someone's around or maybe I'm sensing an aura or a presence using the wind. Uh, then I'll give you. Give me either perception or investigation. Your choice. I'm gonna go perception. Okay. Always choose your best option. Big bucks, no whammy, and Mine stop. Plus six. Man. That's what I'll be Ooh, doing. that hit the. Oh darn! I thought it. Uh, I uh, I thought it hit the eighteen. Ten. It hit ten. Mm-hmm. It's a room. There's a clock on the floor. There's a furnace in front of you. <laughs> That's, <amazing. laughs> That's about like it. The wind is like I think it's, uh, it's a room with a room with no windows. What did you do? <laughs> That's about it. 
not sensing anything. Yeah. Okay, when you're not telling me much, you're not feeling anything. Hmm. Mm-hmm. But I, and nobody else is with me, right? I'm just by myself. No, you got the no, I'm trying and all of y'all just came down the portal. Okay. All y'all just came down. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Y'all came down basically back to back to back. The only person you don't go. see is me. Everybody else is with you. Right. Oh, okay. Then I'll okay. Mm-hmm. We just got a room. I, I said, well, my wings Diesel walked over to the to the little green spot on the floor over here. The automaton is following Diesel. You just watch him talk to him, touch the hearth, and then go over that way. So the automaton's following him. What would you like to do? Hmm. I mean, you hear it clicking every so many, you know what I'm saying, every little while. You hear it clicking, but that's about it. Hmm. Maybe, I can yeah, it. maybe I can focus on the clicking, maybe. Maybe I don't hope. When's not picking up nothing? Maybe I can investigate the clicking. Maybe it's a pattern, or maybe it's Morse code or something. I don't know. You can. Uh, you, if you want, you, that would be an investigation, investigation for that one. It will be a higher DC. It will be a hard difficulty challenge because you've already done one and looked, and you really didn't see nothing. So it's going to be a little bit higher this time. Hmm. But you can do an investigation. Hmm. Did he do investigation the first time? I did perception. He did perception. The first time. And process is one of my stronger pluses. So. Hmm. It's too it's too big of a risk. I mean, I could give it a shot, but hmm. I mean, y'all all in the same room together right now, so you know what I mean? It's not like you know where. It's up to you. Hmm. I might as well just yell away. Like I said, I'm just yell on that bitch, bro. Maybe you're gonna find me. Maybe you won't. Who knows? I rolled an eight. Fascinating. Yeah, you, <laughs> I, I, I think I'm just off because I didn't want to go through that portal. That's probably it. Like you're still that is definitely room. it. Nigga, you, you know, definitely still having regrets, nigga. The wind is just not, it's not you're not feeling a flow, like yeah, you're you clicking, it, but it's it. like a dis discorded clicking. It's like click, 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 click. It's like random, like you're in a clockwork tower, you know what I mean? And everything's ticking. That's what it sounds like to you right now. Um so you just like you you know forget this just kind of walk over I'm assuming you just walk over to everybody else sound about right so Jay isn't here he's not I don't want to know I don't know what he would do I do he would I, be do. Like, I, I think he would leave him personally leave his ass in the room yeah he would he really would um, <laughs> he's like so he's he's like, he probably this would right now. Um, so it's back on me, bitch. But, but, do you want to try to come out of that room again? Who, me? I give you one more chance. Yeah, let's go. Fuck it. What, can All I right. try to do that to figure out what the fuck that thing is? The not you the broken mean, one, but the one that... check, don't mean you'll be able to use it, but you can try to roll one. The, yeah, the one that's arcana. not broken. Yeah, you can roll an arcana check. That's an arcana? Arcana. What is that shit? Arcana is the arcane. No, I map. know what Arcana is. What's that shit yeah. on the floor? Nigga? You gotta see what it is. You oh, gotta I roll an Arcana know. check. You can find out what it is first. No, <laughs> you gotta. You, this is you doing the research. Like this is you going. <laughs> All right, what's the, the options? What's the options? The Arcana shit nope. for the thing on the floor the or what? Whatever you want to do. You can try to get out. You can try to go see what else on the floor. You can try to figure out what the clock is. It's up to you. What about the the dial? You can try to figure that out too. It's still what Arcana. Is that, what magic. is that for? That's Arcana too. It's yes, yeah, Arcana. It's still magic. What is not Arcana? What else is in the room? The door. That, that there you go. <laughs> That's not Arcana. Though. What's that? I mean, it's just a door. I mean, you still got to investigate the timing of the locks to get yourself so back out. Investigation. Though. That's what I'm asking. Like, what is the thing? Investigate? Yeah, it be an investigation. Oh, okay. okay it's going to be harder because you tried it once and then you failed. It like, so it's going to be a little harder this time. Because you're going to have to I'm sit there. Do all kind of shit, bro. Let's go. Do I want yeah. the... Do I want the what dollar? Are you looking or into? Do I want... That's what I'm trying to think. If I want the dollar, I want that. Nah, I'm broke. Let me get a, a zoom in on that shit. Which one? The the one that's not broken. 
Okay. Because it looked like there's something next to it too. Oh, that you can see it's it's like a the furniture you saw in the first room, but the flame is a blue. Oh, it's a furnace. Light, it's like another. It's a small furnace, like a small fire, but it's a light blue. Okay. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So I so wait. These dials on the floor, they own, uh, are they one way or are they two way? It think of a regular clock, right? Hour, minute, second hand. All right, so they the might be two way. Because I just don't, I don't want to investigate this shit if I can't use it to leave. You probably I, you won't know until you check. I know, but I'm saying because. Motherfuckers could come in, but they can't go out. That's definitely I true. I don't want to waste my shit, bro. Or find hey, out. I up can't to even you. use it to go where. Because I'm trying That's to get the only the way you figure it out. out. But not go back the way. I'm trying to <laughs> stay on my own still. <laughs> that until you look into it, you right, won't and know. what's the what's the furnace shit? The what? It's just the, it just looks like just like a normal like a fire like the other one. It's just blue. It's just like a furnace. Yeah, blue looks right. like a blue. Um, blue fuck it, let's go. We going we going with the dial. The dial. Yes. Right. Give me an arcana check. Can I can I do an investigate to find out if I can go out of it and then do arcana to see if I can use it? Will it? Be arcana to see what type of magic it is first. Oh, okay. And then All an right. investigation to see how to use it if need be. Okay. Yeah. The arcana is going to determine most of it for you, though. All right. Here we go. Let's go arcana. Bitch, nigga, let's go. Here we go. Wait, what the fuck is... Nigga, that's not what I wanted. Roll the shit, bitch. Oh. Uh, 20, my nigga. Let's go. 20. Fuck you talking about? So, dirty 20. I'm dirty out 20. here, boy. I'm out here with the Arcana, nigga, plus zero. Roll that 20. You're nigga. right. Oh, no. Was it that 20? Okay, I thought it was a plus. Okay, nat 20? Nah, oh. that's a straight up 20, bro. With a straight yeah, up nat 20. No plus, nigga. You realize, Plus, nigga, when I said I ain't got no arcana, nigga, I ain't got no. Arcana. You meant none, clearly. That uh, so you notice uh -huh. this is a clock of teleportation, but it is a ending point. It's it is what? not a transition point to go to somewhere. This is where you. This is where you land. Bro, are you fucking serious, my nigga? Wasting shit. This is where you land. Point, this is not a uh, a direct point out. Way station. You just want me to go back to these niggas. That's what it is, bro. It's a way station. It is what it is. You just trying to fuck up. Well, I, I rolled the 20, though, so I get to do something else, too, nigga. Fuck out of here. No, that was just you figuring out if it works and how to work it. Right. That was what it was. That's it? That was That's what it is. You know it's a teleportation point. You know it's where you would land from somewhere. Right, but I'm There's saying, like, my turnover point. or... It's not a turn. It's just what you. What did you want to do? Oh, okay. That's what I'm asking, nigga. That's yeah, yeah no. I mean, I was, so I was like, shit. now I know I can't use it to get the fuck out. Let me check the fucking furnace shit. Okay. Need another kind of check on that. Also, kind of right. Uh huh. All right, let's go. Come on, Akana again, my nigga. That's a fucking six. Six. Um. That's something more like it. It's a sigil. It does magic. Okay. You don't know what kind. But I don't know. Hell, I was gonna say no definitely clue. don't know. Not with a six, nigga. Not Shit. a nope. Not a nothing. All right, no. go go back to the Laxodon, nigga. <laughs> All right, so you're gonna sit there for a minute. Nothing you gonna look at, bro. So, it's like, so you're gonna stay in, okay, you're gonna stay in the room? Cool. Oh, I, I still right, get so more. It's not a it's not turns, it's what do you want to do? Oh, nigga, I I mean I, I thought that was it. Nigga shit. I, no, I mean if you want to if you want to just chill for a minute and be like, all right, I'm gonna think of this. Question. If I if I be like yo, I'm chilling, then I get you another at that shit again, right? Like it'll just you, be harder. You, go, 
every time, right? Every time the the level, the number you got to roll more. Goes I want higher. more, so I'm gonna let them go. You gonna sit there and chill? More. I want one okay. more. Cool, cool, cool. All right, so Diesel and Jen. Yeah, I'm assuming y'all y'all out, right? Yep. Yeah, is... okay. Put the portal. Cool, because yeah, Diesel's on a mission clearly. So yeah, Diesel trying to get um, out. You again, you know where you are. You've been here before. This is a this is a typical landing pad for this destination, this realm. Um, you know it doesn't take much. You'll sit there. You produce a small flame from your hands. Is the um palm the a uh, palmatron shit going with them niggas? Everybody, yeah, everybody out. Everybody out. All right, cool. <laughs> so sure. there's a small flame from your hands and it just hold you just hold it up in front of you uh and say open and as you do the light just like opens a little uh like a spherical beam rings around you constantly in like waves pulsing up from the ground uh and most of you are already on it and as the automaton you hold the flame in your hand until the automaton finally enters the ring and then you close your hand extinguishing the flame and as you do you all disappear and you land outside of a building this is a very familiar place to you it is uh, is it familiar 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 okay it is uh, basically a place of trade, a place of mm, business. This is where contracts are given and left in the land of Yagpa. This is the Citadel, Citadel Cathedral. It looks like a homely... Cornfield, like Indiana. <laughs> right? It looks like a homely little cornfield barn. Uh, and next to it, there's a signpost with different contracts on it. There is uh, various small brush type plants that are uh, desert bound, it looks like. You look up in the sky, it's completely grayed out. There is no sunlight in this area. Uh, the sands under your feet are desert and sandy at the same time. Um, sparse dried grasses, things of that nature. Uh, it is a barren landscape. You know this is just where you are. You are on basically you call it, some people call it level, some people call it dimension, some people call it plane. It is the 24th level of this universe. Oh shit, no, no. Looking at the you know, glance around and take a deep breath. You have one thing in mind at this point. And that is you must get home. You must get the queen. And that's where we're going to end everything tonight. All right. All right. So, appreciate everybody kicking with us as long as you did. I apologize it took a little longer. Um, we will start off next time with Vocab trying his one more round. <laughs> yeah, bro, because I need to get no screen so time, bro. really, bro. Bro, you dipped out. They, it's not our fault. We can't do nothing about that. The story got to go on. Saying, they, 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 <laughs> was long, they, they was long. They, they was long. Yeah, you. But you, you dipped. Like we had to get through everything else. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> so, uh, other than that, though, uh, normal show as always next week. As long as nothing yeah, no tragic more. happens, um, October first. Uh, next next month, I will tell y'all now. We probably we may not have a game. 
It may not. Um, I have very important business to attend to that weekend, and Rod will also be gone that weekend. Mm -hmm. So with two of us out, we probably won't have a game next week, next month. Uh, We'll probably catch back up in, heck, maybe November. We'll see. We'll have to plan this out. It might not be until January we come back. I'm not going to lie. I apologize. January? Holiday and Thanksgiving like, on the last weekend of the month. <laughs> so, uh, but yeah, other than that, we appreciate y'all swinging through again. It is the Pando Pandemonium. This is the Chaos Crew. Uh, we had Deron. Appreciate you swinging through with us, bro. And kicking hey, man. Yeah. Thanks for having me. Always, always. So, we'll definitely hopefully see him back as Diesel the Loxodon Barbarian. Hey, you big ass motherfucking <laughs> the tank. <laughs> Roll some better die next time, though. Hey, it ain't nothing but a on the dice next time. <laughs> but shoot, y'all have a great one, and we will catch y'all later. I am Here. Out. Stay black. Y'all later. Peace Stay out. Dangerous.